Hello everyone. Hello and welcome to the stream. Um, I'm going to treat this like kind of a video for those of you watching the VOD. Hello. I have great stuff here for you today. Stick around or maybe skip like 30 seconds in. Um, for those of you that aren't watching the VOD. Hello and welcome to the live stream. I hope you're doing well. Today, we've got maybe a build, but maybe a keycap review. And that's pretty exciting. Maybe a build, maybe a keycap review. Maybe both. I haven't decided that yet, but I'm going to decide that soon. I'm not sure whether or not I feel like building a keyboard or just looking at keycaps. Granted, if I look at keycaps, I'm going to have to put them on a keyboard, but that won't be a full build, so there's a slight difference. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the stream. Um, for those of you just filtering in, hello. Today, I am either building a keyboard or look, reviewing keycaps. Not sure which yet. That's true, I can't really go wild with $250. Um, no matter what, regardless of what is happening, I will be looking at these keycaps. These are the Akko ASA PBT double shot little tall boys. So we're going to take a look at them. I don't know if they're any good. Um, I don't know how the quality is. I don't know if they're going to sound good, but a lot of people have been saying I should, ooh, that was rattling around a little bit. A lot of people have been saying I should take a look at these. So I, uh, I might be taking a look at these. Glarses. What if I give Glarses $69 to go wild? What then? What would happen? But hello, welcome to the stream. Also, with those keycaps, I do have a keyboard that I might build today, but it's a Skylong GK68 acrylic. It's not very exciting, but it could be exciting. So I might build it. And then along with that, uh, evidently, Epo Maker that sent me out the stuff doesn't really have a good Switch collection. They've started to get better Switch collections, but I really don't recommend buying Switches from them. Um, I've got some L1s that I lubed up myself. I don't know if these are going to be good. They could be good. They could suck. Who knows? I, I actually know how these are. I'm just being, I'm being facetious with you. And then we have something that might get delivered during the course of the stream that I might be able to look at, but I'm not sure yet. But it might get delivered in the middle of the stream. So all I'm saying is stick around for that. That could be very interesting. Zoom. <laughs> yeah, you like it when I have a webcam that can zoom? You find that intriguing? I find that intriguing. I should mod Glarces, shouldn't I? I guess I could. Hold on. I find that intriguing. Oh. Ah, I hear myself. I hate that. That's my least favorite thing. How, what do you guys think of your own voices? I really don't like my own voice. There we go. Congratulations, Glarces. You're a mod. You can ban anyone you want. It's your own privilege. Okay. Anyways, I think I'm just going to get right off into it, you know? Oh, what's this on my water bottle? Is this a Hippio Tech sticker from my merch store that's been newly updated with new designs? Wow. Oh, what's this water bottle? Oh, they could type exclamation point merch to go check out my new stickers from my merch store, like this drink water sticker. That's pretty crazy. You guys should check that out. You should type exclamation point merch and look at my new updated merch store. We've got new designs and everything. Oh, wait a second. If I mention that I like MX Browns, will Glarces ban me? Haha, -ha, MX Browns funny, right? Am I right? MX Browns so funny. Ah, oh, that's classic. Isn't that just hilarious? <laughs> I bet you're totally not sick of that. Oh, man. Yeah. I bet you've never been sick of that. Anyways, so I'm going on vacation next week. We're going on vacation next week. I'm going to attempt to film a video to go live while I'm on vacation. Who knows? 
you know you might see a video you might not see a video if you don't you know that sucks doesn't it yeah that would just suck haha <laughs> funny anyways do we go full vlog already let's go full vlog already yeah oh yeah dude the hoodie's pretty cool you should get the hoodie why not why not buy the hoodie from my merch store okay we're going vlog hippio already that's pretty great what, what do you guys think of vlogging should i start a vlog channel hey guys today we're going to the gym and when we go to the gym we're gonna work out you know when you work out you gotta stay motivated and uh when you stay motivated you gotta <laughs> buy my merch haha <laughs> Yeah, that I don't. I wouldn't like that. I'm gonna be honest. Okay, a clickbait vlogger. Evidently, I'm a clickbait YouTuber, so I could be a clickbait vlogger. You know, I don't. I don't make the clickbait rules. YouTube makes the clickbait rules, right? YouTube tells me, oh, you don't clickbait, you don't get views. What, what do I do? What do I do with that? Do I not clickbait? That's that's crazy. That would be insane. That would be against every fiber of my being. No, I try not to actually clickbait. Um, like, I'll be a little bit exaggerative. I'll be a little bit something. But I won't straight up be like, Oh, this keyboard can literally end world hunger? Like... I won't do that. That's that's really clickbaity. Anyways, you know what I'm gonna do? Yeah, I t I don't have a hippio chalk bag. I'm very sorry. The my merch store doesn't design chalk bags. Um, I use Spreadshirt for my merch. They're not perfect. The quality's okay. Oh, you know. Hello, a bird. Thank you for clicking on my bait. There we go. Let me get this camera all set up. Here, you can see I was looking at the Epo Maker website. Isn't that exciting? Oh, there we go. Chalk bags are for rock climbing. They hold your chalk. Isn't that great? It's a bag for your chalk. That's why they call it a chalk bag. Let me... My full cam is a little bit off. Oh, well. That's good enough, I guess. Also, if you've mentioned, if you've noticed, we do have a new goal for this stream. Apparently, people didn't like the idea of my last goal, so I got a different goal. Um, this new stream goal is... PBT Toby proto reveal. And I'll do that at uh why is it so small? PBT Toby proto reveal. I'll do that at 110 members. But yeah. Maybe. Just maybe. If it gets here. If it doesn't get here, yikes. That's a big yikes. So, first things first. Here we go. I'm sorry, I moved your health bar. Please forgive me. Oh, this is backwards. There we go. So, we've got a Skyloon box. This is nothing new, if you know my YouTube channel. Oh, that's why it was backwards. This is a GK68XS. Emphasis on the made in China. Um, let's open her up, eh? Come on. There we go. I have so many boxes that look like this. Oh. Okay. We've got a manual. A very overexposed manual. And a very interesting bag, which I reckon is a carrying case. Oh. What's going on here? What? Oh. Okay. So, 
here's a funny story. Funny story, haha. Originally, they were going to send me switches for this build, and they sent me 10. I said, hey, could you send out this board with the Gateron Yellows? Because, you know, I'm hip yo with the Gateron Yellows. I can't even open this. Uh, and um, they sent out 10 Gateron Yellows. I repeat, 10. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with 10. I guess I could put them in the build as a, as a funny little joke. Um, here you can see we've got a switch puller and a keycap puller. They're both kind of stinky, but at least they're here. I can't complain. I have 100 of these USB-C cables. This must be the cheapest cable in China, the same color. It comes in Idobao builds. It comes in every Epo Maker build. Like, so, it, it's like pseudo premium, I guess. It's fine. And then, um, 10, 10 Gateron Yells. Why are my hands so, my white balance is off. My hands are very not this red. There we go. So yeah, 10 Gateron Yellows. They smell like nothing. I mean, honestly, Gateron Yellows are pretty great. So, yeah. But I don't know what I'm gonna do with 10. And then a, uh, a split space bar module, which I won't use. But it's really cool that these include it. Um, if you want a split space bar, you can have a split space bar. Yeah. Neato. FR4 plate? I don't think it's an FR4 plate. Woo! All right. So that's the board. Here, you know what I could do? I could put my chat in front of me, then I can read it a little bit better. Okay. So the board itself that I don't know if I'm building yet, let's get that open day. Eh? So it's got a weird flap. You open the weird flap to reveal. Oh, maybe it is an FR4 plate. Or I think that's aluminum, honestly, but we'll check. To reveal the board in very shiny plastic wrap. And we will open this up. The white balance keeps going way off because it wants to make the pink white. Um, you know, typical Hippio stream. I think for a stream camera, I might get a, uh, a camera that has an auto white balance lock. So I can fine tune my white balance and then lock it in. Ah, what does this say? I think this tells you how to Replace the spacebar module and how to install hot swap sockets. Um, I guess it might be FR4, sorry. Hold on. I could get some B-roll of it. And then I can read the listing. Let me get... Hello, Elijah. Hello. Okay, let me get some B-roll of it, and then uh, let me read you what the listing says, eh? Um, hmm. Bold acrylic design. Uh, I don't see where it says, but I think it's FR4. I don't think it says FR4 on the listing. Just, uh, that's my first impression. But... It seems FR4-y. Which is not scientific at all. You know, like, the vibe is kinda like FR4, dude. It's got an FR4 vibe, I reckon. You know, I feel the FR4 vibe. Um, so sadly, this water bottle isn't available on my store, um, but I guess I could put an Amazon affiliate link in it. If I, you know what, click on the link for my camera and then go look up the Vimini water bottle on Amazon and then you can buy my water bottle. 
But it's not a Hippio water bottle, it's just Hippio colors. It is in fact FR4, says Cool Keys. I believe you. Because it looks, I'm getting the FR4 vibe. Um, hold on. So let me flip it real fast. I'm just getting some backup B-roll for if I forget to do anything. Always good to have backup B-roll. Okay. But yeah, so I don't know. This board is priced pretty expensive. And I reckon the value just might not be here. Like, it's $175 US. And at 175 US for the for the kit, that's the kit, so unbuilt. That's uh, that's a bit of a doozy for what I think you're getting. Ow. God, that hurt. I just dropped it on my finger. I'm trying to do B-roll of it and get it to stand up. Will you stand up? Will the real Slim Shady please stand up? Okay. That's balanced. So it's got a USB-C port. Look at it go. <laughs> that sounds pretty good when it hits my finger. Yeah, you know, you know the thock of this board, dude? It's pretty freaking thocky when it hits my finger and then goes, ow. I should put that in the thumbnail. Um, so I actually, I have an AK-84, but they sent it to me with clicky switches, and I said, no, I will not review your board with clicky switches. You will not like the outcome from, uh, that review. <laughs> like, I don't know. Like, I could tear it a new one because I hate clicky switches, and I don't think clicky switches could ever sound good. But I feel like that wouldn't be a useful video to people. I don't know. Does being in the watering hole gang help the sound of my keyboard? I wish it, I wish I could say it does. You know, in fact, maybe because you're around all of us who really know something-ish, kind of, maybe, about keyboards, then maybe, yeah. So this is hot swap. It, it is hot swap, but they sent it to me with optical blues. They sent it to me with optical blues. <laughs> like... I was, I was pretty tilted. I mean, whatever. I don't care that much. But it looked like a good budget 75%, so I wanted to review it. And I went, optical blues! Ah! Which, there's somebody out there that likes optical blues. But I really don't. I am not one of those people that likes optical blues. I don't know, how many of you like blues? at all. And then how many of you like optical blues? Or, sorry, uh, standard MX style clicky switches. There. Like, not fun click bar stuff, not box jades. Like, that's fine if you like it, that's perfect if you like it. I'm just not one of those people, you know? Ah, SV. Welcome to the watering hole, gang. Welcome, welcome. Let me drink some water in your honor. Welcome. Great to have you here. I hope you're doing well. All right, let me do this. Let me get a shot of its butt. Oh, like this. I really like the, um, the sculpt of this case, actually. Like, I don't think it's going to be very good. But I like the fact that it's like a little gemstone. It reminds me of the Karina, but just 65%. Or, uh, it feels really similar to, like, the KL90, honestly. The polycarbonate KL90. But I reckon this is acrylic and not polycarbonate. Which, just between you and me. I think I prefer polycarbonate. You're doing your Korean homework and watching stream. Well, that's pretty dope, actually. 
that's pretty dope. Okay, so I think that's really all I need to show of this part. Um, yeah, Elijah, we've been blowing up. We've been blowing up. Tell your friends, tell your mom, tell your cat, tell your mom's cat that we've been blowing up. You know, maybe she'll find it interesting. There's another B-roll shot. Would you make a cable for a video? You know, one of my old videos, I made a DIY cable and it was actually rather popular for the time. Um, once I get settled moving, I'd like to do another DIY cable video. Um, but honestly, just between you and me, I really hate coiled cables. Uh, or sorry, hate is a strong word. I dislike the aesthetic personally of coiled cables. There, is that better? Okay. Yeah, I personally dislike the aesthetic of coiled cables. So that's just me, though. All right, let me plug her in real fast. Oh god, it's gonna be bright. Oh, that's very bright. Holy moly. Ah. Is, is this how you shoot Hippio B-roll with your hand? <laughs> oh, that is actually the weirdest underglow I've ever seen in a board. So you've got three here, and then a line here, and then three here. I think that leads to a very odd underglow. I don't know. I digress. But it's so bright. I'm going to have to unplug it soon. Hold on. Let me get... I need to get a B-roll of its full potential. But the cable doesn't match. Please forgive. Okay. There we go. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Very bright. Like my eyes are, I'm actually, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm squinting right now. So if you're one of those RGB gamers, emphasis on the RGB, then yeah, that's pretty good. The, the back ones are super bright, like ultra bright. Wow. And as you can see, there is a battery in there. Um, so that means, uh, you can run it wireless somehow. Oh no. Oh no. Is it not going to turn off now? Oh God. Oh, is there like a reset button on here? It won't turn off. FN and tab? Oh. Okay. Uh, that's a con. <laughs> Don't plug it in. Also, did I mention north facing LEDs? Also, potentially a con. FN and tab, you said? This better be right. Tell me it works. It's not working. It's not working. It's not working. I'm holding F at a tab. The problem with north facing LEDs is if you use cherry profile keycaps, then you will have some interference in the middle row. FN and backspace, you've lied to me. How dare you?
That's a very, very tight plate. FN and backspace. Ah, tell me this is right. Guys. No, it says FN. It said FN on the motherboard. Well, nothing's turning off. Did they rebind the FN button? Did I accidentally bend a pin? I'm gonna go blind, you guys. All right, let's pull it out sideways. Come on, where's my good keycap puller? Look at the manual, I can't. My eyes don't work anymore. I didn't bend the pen. <sighs> the manual. Yeah, it should be FN and tab. Was that not actually FN then? Why? Why, God? Okay, let me do this. Do I have to plug it in to turn it off? What? What? Banggood gave me, or freaking Epo Maker gave me $250 and a seizure. Ah! Oh. Screw you. Yeah, so uh, it has to be plugged in for the commands to work. That's stupid. <laughs> so I hate that. Um, I hate that a lot. Okay, anyways, thank you for your contribution. Do we think we can fit foam in here? Or is, do we think this is pretty tight? I think it's pretty tight. There's some definitely some weird flex around the spacebar module because it's like a separate module. So I don't know if that's good. Okay, well anyways. We've got the GK68XS here. Oops. Am I gonna O-ring mount it? Maybe in the future. I don't have O-rings on me. So it's definitely light. Um, it's definitely light. It's got a USB-C port. It has north facing LEDs, which is a little bit stinky, but also hot swap sockets, which is slightly less stinky. Five pin support, which can't be said about some boards and a whole lot of screws connecting the, it's tray mount. So yeah, you get what you get and you cry about it. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna need to lube these stabilizers, I think. Well, you know what? I think I might treat them at face value because they've been factory lubed. So we'll see how they go with factory lubing. Yeah, so let's let's tease the, we'll give them a shot. We'll give them a shot. Let me get one more B-roll shot of um, 
the this. There we go. Okay, and then after this, we'll take a look at the switches and keycaps. I'm gonna get like a face value test of it, and maybe I'll tweak it a little bit. This today's gonna be a shorter stream. We're not gonna get too crazy today. Mostly because I don't have a lot of time to edit this video. I'm going on vacation uh, next week. So, we're going on vacation next week. That's a, this, this is what it is. So, for the switches. We've got some Kinetic Labs switches. Because, remember how they sent me 10 Gather on yellows? That ain't gonna work for this build. So I have my replacement, which is Duroc L series switches. These little guys have been lubed by yours truly with Carbon GS2. Let me get some Carbon GS2 for the B-roll. Hold on. There we go. Let me grab some Carbon GS2. Oh, what's this? Is this my, my Hippio Tech lube pouch that you can purchase by typing exclamation point merch and visiting my Spreadshirt shop down below? Wow. That is my Hippiotech lube pouch. Guess what, guys? It's made out of hemp. 420 funny. Huh. You can buy this from the link in the description. I keep all my lube in there. It's actually really, really handy. Um, yeah. I've already given all my money to you. Well, that's unfortunate. But there's somebody out there that hasn't. Therefore, I shill, therefore I am. You know? I shill, therefore I am. Hold on. Okay, so. Can you O-ring mount any keyboard? Probably not any keyboard. There's probably a keyboard out there that you can't O-ring mount. I'm gonna be real with you there. Oh, we going wild. There we go. Let me pop this open. That way, it looks like lube. Nice. Nice little B-roll. Yeah, so I've lubed these up previously with Carbon GS2. This is a decently thin lube, and honestly, I don't really recommend lubing linears with it unless they're already like pretty buttery smooth. Um, I kind of just prefer Crytox overall, but it's not, it's not the worst. My spacebar keeps popping out of the stabilizer. Um, Put some tape, some some painter's tape or something, over the uh, the hole that keeps popping out. There's your pro hippie tip. Normally I don't give pro hippie tips on stream, but there's a pro hippie tip. All right, so let me put away my lube in my hippie tech lube pouch. By the way, hippie tech lube pouch exclamation point merch. All right, and then I'm gonna build the keyboard. Hemp infused lube, that would be pretty dope actually. All right. Let me set this all the way over here. Uh, there we go.
I think I'm gonna do a magic. So I'm gonna get a before and after for the magic. But I don't know if I'm gonna do the magic. Nice toast, thank you so much. I actually grew them myself. Okay. Yeah, you know what? I'm just doing a magic today. No B-roll. Just a magic. Ow, ooh, ow. You guys ever hit your like Achilles heel on your uh, on your chair? That was a little bit painful. I'm just gonna build this out how it is, you know? Honestly? Like, it. I think it's FR4 is the plate material, but it's not that good. No, 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 all my magic is real. All of my magic is real. Don't you worry, all right? Don't you worry. Sorry, I forgot I was in the wrong, um, the wrong mode this whole time. Oh, God. Why, God? I'm sorry. Now the face cam's a little bit more tilted. Now it's a little bit more tilted. <laughs> I love the. Uh, hold on. Let me move my webcam and my stream labels down here. I'm gonna make them a little bit bigger. Perfect. Okay. Yeah. Or do we want them over here? My webcam and my stream labels over here. Yeah, why not? Let's move them to the top. That's good. Not blocking any views. <laughs> These are Duroc L1s. If you'd like to purchase some Duroc L1s, you could do it from the description down below or by typing exclamation point KL. They are an affiliate, but not a sponsor. There we go. Okay. So. Why is it focusing on my arm? I swear I told you to focus on that. Huh. Boom. What keycaps are you using? Oh. Well, you're just going to have to stick around and find out. There's some pretty interesting keycaps. They are black and pink. And they are budget-ish. Budget-ish. I don't know what I did to these switches before when I was using them, but all oh, so many of them are bent. This is a disaster. I've disgraced my Switch collection. But, you know, we tried our best. Yeah. So, boards like this used to be a really good proposition. Um, like, the GK68XS used to be pretty appealing. But nowadays, it's kind of fallen out of fashion with things like the KBD67 Lite and the NK65 becoming more widely available and in stock more frequently. Um, that means less wait times more competition, etc. So honestly, I think this board doesn't really have a place anymore. But when I build it out, we'll find that out for sure. Uh, I got this one from Epo Maker. The plate does not look like aluminum though. It's, uh, it's got the FR4 vibe. It also doesn't feel like aluminum, it feels like FR4. It'd be pretty weird to have an aluminum with this type of finish. Can I use cherry type switches on this board? Yes, you can. Yeah. So it supports basically any cherry five pin. It would support three pins too, but let's be real here. Nobody, nobody wants to use three pins. Um, but yeah, anybody know how much the KBD67 light two is off the top of their head how much is the kbd67 light two um and then how much is the icky aurora off the top of your head what do we think chat because this board right here i mean the normal version is 85 but 
this version is 175. Oof, yeah, that's, so that's a hard bargain. I mean, obviously it's not Bluetooth. So this has Bluetooth connectivity, which makes it more appealing than some other stuff. If that's what you care about. Um, are there, that's actually a good point then. So if you, the only thing you care about is in the KVD67 is Bluetooth? Is it really? How much extra? Um, cause that could be pretty interesting. So how much for the KVD67? Icky68 Bluetooth only costs 150. That's true. Icky68 does not in stock very often. And the lead times are pretty crazy. So I kind of have to take that as like a massive con to any of those boards. Because if somebody comes to me and they say, I want a keyboard right now. There's very few options in that respect. And that's the biggest gap in the keyboard market right now. Because if they come to me and they say, I want a keyboard right now, this is an option. Um, whether or not it's a good one, we don't know yet, but it is an option. Because it's in stock. Um, are those Gateron Milky Yellows? No, they're Duroc L1s. We have a fancy thing called exclamation point build on this stream. When you type it out, it'll tell you what the build is. We also have some fun other commands on this stream, such as exclamation point join and exclamation point merch. That's, those are my favorite of any of them. If you're, if you're curious. Have you ever tried Duroc Palms? I have not, no. I haven't. But yeah, if you guys see people asking, oh, what's that switch? What's that keycap? What's that board? You can tell them exclamation point build, or you could just type exclamation point build and then they'll realize the error of their way. Oh, this is a very bent pin. Wow, what have I done? Hmm. Very interesting. They're bending pins. Yeah, KTT Roses seem to be very frequently sold out. Um, I heard that they're restocking on Dang Keebs. Hopefully in the next month or so. I heard through a grapevine and then a different grapevine. So, that's a possibility. That's always a possibility. Ugh. Did I forget to stream ping? I think I forgot to stream ping. Hold on. Let me just do something, which, there we go. Um, let me send out a stream ping. Um, there, okay. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry to anyone that's a member of my Discord and has the stream ping role. Um, I did forget. Usually I send out a, a little ping on Discord anytime I go live. I forgot today. Today I didn't really think I was going to stream. And then I woke up and I said, ah, you know what? I'll say hi to everyone. I'll say hello. I'll build a little keyboard. I'll have a little fun time. I'll see what, what happens along the way, you know? And we will see what happens along the way. This is going to be a very light keyboard. This is my first Hippio stream. Well, welcome. I hope you're enjoying yourself. You know, we try to have a good time here. We're here for the chill vibes. We're here for the uh, the good times. Yeah. How to lube a progressive spring. Uh, cry, cry a lot, you know. I always just bag lube all my springs, honestly. I, I never lube springs by hand. I cannot be bothered. I really can't. Hmm. There we go. Yeah. 
Ah, Joseph, hello. Well, thank you for the $5. Happy Friday, hope you've got exciting weekend plans. Hmm. Well, honestly, my, my weekend plans are pretty, uh, I guess, interestingly stressful. You know, I've got to prep a lot of work because I'm going on vacation next week. So my weekend plans aren't very exciting. Lots of video editing, lots of filming. Um, there's a couple projects that are behind the scenes that I need to get done before I leave. I'm only going for a couple days, but a couple days right now is uh, a lot of time. <laughs> All right, there we go. But I hope you're doing good, Joseph. I hope you have exciting weekend plans. To where? I'm just going to the beach. Uh, going to the beach with a large group of friends that are all vaccinated. Um, we're celebrating graduation. I never got to celebrate it. I graduated in December. Um, some of my best buds have graduated. And we're just going to go out. We're going to celebrate. We're going to have a good time. Nothing too crazy. I'm going to go rock climbing a lot. It's going to be fun, actually. Yeah. I've got a rock climb down at the beach that I... One key isn't in all the way. Which one? I've got a rock climb down at the beach that I really need to do. So I'm going to go do that. Hoping to finish up a 3D printer rebuild this weekend. Ooh, barbecues and beer tonight sound very nice. Very nice. Okay. There's my magic. The magic happened. Second row. Oh, this one. There we go. I probably just bent it, honestly. Thank you for the, the advice. There we go. Oh well. So there we go. We've got the build. Uh, this is... <laughs> is that how we build? Let me get a B-roll or so. Um, if you want to see something on Aqua Kings, check out my cyberboard video. I built out my cyberboard with Aqua Kings, and it was very interesting. So make sure you check that out. Yeah. <laughs> Is this just point out every switch that Hippio did not put in correctly, the stream? I'll figure it out later. Don't worry. So these are Duroc yellows, which is pretty interesting. Duroc L1s, Duroc yellows, same difference. They're all available in the description down below. There's a pro tip for, for all of y'all. Basically, almost always, I put everything in the description. They're always affiliate links, of course. But, you know, we gotta make money somehow. Gotta make money somehow. There we go. Get some B-roll. This is the part of the video where I normally go. And now, after the magic has happened, we're gonna build the keyboard with some keycaps. Boo, 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 boo. Or something like that. 61%. Thank you for the $5. This is my second stream and I gotta ask Hippio, why are you so attractive? Well, that's a great question. I don't know, um, but thank you for the $5. Yeah, thank you. Anyways, let me do one little B-roll over here. Um, that's, I, I, I'm not going to get too creative for this video. I have to be, you know, we really have to try our best. Just have to try our best. 
Uh, if you're new, just now watching the stream, you could type exclamation point build to figure out the build. And you could type exclamation point join to join the watering hole gang. It's a special secret fun club for anyone that watches the streams. Super exclusive. Um, joining the watering hole gets you access to our members only discord where I post behind the scenes stuff. Um, yeah. So there, those are the two things you could do. Hold on. Who's phone calling? Um, hold on. I have to let my housemate know that his groceries got delivered. One moment. Wait. That's DHL. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Um, let me, I'll be right back. I have to go sign for DHL. Be right back.
Okay. All right. One moment. We're back. Taking off our mask. Ugh. Sorry about that. My housemate's groceries got delivered right as uh, DHL showed up and I had to sign for DHL. And then I had taken my housemate's groceries because he's not here and he ordered a bunch of eggs and stuff. I'm such a nice housemate. Oh, hello, Richard. So, anyways, switches is Duroc L1. And I'll take a look at these in a second. Also, did I mention my PBT Toby prototypes got here? And if we get nine more people, you know, hold on. If we get nine more people to hit exclamation point join, I'll show off the second batch of PBT prototypes, PBT Toby prototypes on stream. So nine more people, exclamation point join, and I'll show them off after we finish the build. Otherwise, you're not going to see them on stream. And they might be scuffed. They, I reckon they're kind of scuffed, but we'll see. We'll see. You're going to have to exclamation point join. You're going to have to click that link. Uh, $4.99, you know. Anyways, your voice is so satisfying not to be weird or anything. Well, I appreciate that. I genuinely hate my own voice. So I like that other people appreciate <laughs> what I cannot. Um, through my head, you know, my head acoustics, not very thocky. So, hey, Mr. Thock, for the keycaps. I'll be taking a look at the Akko PBT double shot, black and pink. Um, oops. Black and pink. Please focus. There we go. Black and pink. Which seems more like a black and salmon, to be honest with you. These are ASA profile. They come in a black hard plastic shell. You should do Echo CS switches. I know, I get told every day by like 17 people that saw it on TikTok that I need to do Echo switches. Let's see. Oh, these haven't been messed up too bad. Not as bad as I thought. Um, let me just put this back on. There we go. Yeah. So, here's this batch. Um, honestly, the, the gray in person, it's more like a greenish gray. Um, let me do that. Let me even that out and then it's more like a greenish gray, which I'm not too stoked on. Um, they're pretty, but they're interesting. Yeah, I don't know. It, it's actually coming through almost exactly how I see in person on stream. Um, and then this is actually not showing up exactly how I see it on stream in person. These are like a darker salmon. Um, yeah, and I don't know how I feel about them. What I can say is they didn't clone Olivia. Um, they definitely didn't clone Olivia because these look pretty different. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I don't expect a picture on their website to look exactly the same. I'm just judging them based off of how I see them in person. You know? These are Akko. You can tell by their little Akko logo. And their weird fish and paw and flower and etc. I will use the accents. Um, I'd say they're actually fairly close to the picture in the, on the store, but a little just a little bit more greeny. Um, but you know, it's their own thing. They've got their own legends. Um, they've got their own profile even, which is interesting. Now let's scope out some of these keycaps. So first thing I can see is that 
the stabilizer or not the stabilizer, sorry, the space bar. Come on. Oh, I'm dumb. There we go. First thing I can see is the space bar is a little bit warped. But the double shot process is clean. So there's these weird little marks on some of these keycaps. Like, it's like a scuff, but it's just, it's there. So there's just a permanently there scuff. People say GMK double shot is high quality, but GMK is using really old machines. Their double shot is not very high quality. Like that's high quality double shot. GMK scrap rate is absurd, so I've heard. I don't know if that's true, but I, uh, I've heard that they throw away a lot of keycaps or recycle. They could recycle. I don't know. That looks pretty clean, actually. Let's see. Um, are there any other scuffed keycaps? Ooh. Yeah, there's definitely some scuffs on some of these, like. There's a scratch right here. There's a scratch right here. So the quality control on these is not very good. I think like if they quality controlled it a little bit, it would be it would be better. Yeah. Let me check the thickness. You can buy these from the description if you want. I have them in the description. Okay, so let me check the thickness. One point three six. That's kind of thin. Oh, hold on. One four two. One point four mil. Let me check a GMK cap. Hold on. Let me grab a GMK key cap. And we'll check the thickness of a GMK cap. I think GMK is 1.5 mil. So. Oh. Yeah, no, it's actually... I think it's the same thickness as a GMK cap. Well, 142. I'm doing it the same way on the same type of keycap. 142. I mean, this could be off. It could but that they're both 1.5. But uh, same thickness as GMK. It's double shot PBT. I think it comes in at like $70 US. Um, something like that. But it's a modified SA profile. SA is kind of stinky in my opinion. That's my opinion though, which is fine. Let me put this away. All right, looks like nobody wants to see PBT Toby though. So, oh, Pog, thanks for the $2. That doesn't go towards PPT Toby, but Pog. Um, ah, hold on. My GM kit cap fell on the floor. I must treat it with respect. It doesn't go in the garbage yet. All right, let me put those key caps on. I don't have normal SA to compare to, unfortunately. Okay.
There's our magic. We casted it. Thank you for coming to my magic. Ah! I bumped my tripod and ruined my magic. Hello, I'm short now. Oh, and we're no longer short. Thank you. There we go. Um, did somebody say the difference in chat? They're a lot closer to OEM, but with rounded edges like SA. They seem pretty freaking tall, honestly. I'm gonna be real with you. Oh no. Oh no. That's bad. I'm gonna have to tune that. I thought I could get away without tuning these stabilizers, but uh, I might have to brush on. Might have to brush on some lube. What is this? Which goes where? Is this up? Is this left? Is this down? <laughs> I'm so confused. These are apparently factory lube stabs, so I'm gonna take them at their word and give them, uh, or uh, what's it called? Like, the, the sound test will be with the factory lube stabs. So, not gonna mod those yet. Yeah. So no, no, uh, booby dooby dooby do. So, FN was this. And then I think this was menu. I actually hate this box that they've shipped in them. Or that they've shipped the keycaps in them. Um, because, here's why. Hold on. Uh, I'm gonna put control here. I kinda wanna control here. They let you rebind stuff, right? There's pretty good kidding for this set. Um, no, this is not real Olivia. This is not even fake Olivia. This is Hacko's keycap set. This is its own thing. Akko Black Pink. If anything, they'll get sued by Black Pink. Olivia is based on Rose Gold. Vaguely. Oh, also, Reckonix, you're no longer a member. This is so sad. Were you a me You were a member, right? Oh, no. I might cry. Ah! Well, if you want to rejoin, we've got the, uh... The PBT Toby reveal goal going, I guess. Let me put the pink escape up here. Oh my god. This is so annoying, getting these out. From their case. You'll buy another member thing. Poggers. They look, uh... I just, I think I don't like the alphas. I think if they had white or lighter alphas, I'd be pretty happy. Um, yeah, I don't think I'm the biggest fan of their alphas that they chose. Cause they're like a green, a grain, they're a grain, a gray green. They somehow made these stabilizers mushy and rattly, which is honestly impressive. Um, I've seen some good Skylung stabilizers in my day. This ain't it. <sighs> this ain't it, Chief. Actually, the backspace is good, though. I think the, the, uh... So, the box is nice, right? The box is nice, but it's also infuriating to remove keycaps from. Am I the only one that just prefers to have keycaps in like a bag? Is that, is, am I crazy for liking that? 
I don't know. Maybe I am. Maybe I am. So, let me put a delete up here. And then a page up and down. Can you talk a little German? I... Don't think I know much in German, but I do know the word for spatula in German is hilarious. I know that. Yeah. <laughs> That's all I got, though. So, I reckon this is the page up we're looking for. And then we want this page down. Question mark. I think so. That delete could be the wrong profile. But, oh, I think this is the right delete. Hold on. Ah, here we go. There we go. Yeah, this has pretty good layout support, honestly, for being such a cheap set. Um, for layout support, I mean, this is a super non-standard board with the three little keys over here, the 175U right shift. So in that case, it's pretty good. Oh, hey, Sviz. Hello. Oh, well, hello and goodbye. I didn't see you there. You need to become a member of the Watering Hole Gang so your name stands out. There we go. That, that's the only reason. And so you can see the scuffed PBT Toby prototypes that just arrived. But, you know, it is what it is. Um, I could show the box after I'm done putting the keycaps on. But this box kind of sucks. Um, you could check these keycaps out in the description, Nathan. Your stabs weren't bad? Yeah, I found that Skyloom stabs are massively hit or miss. Um, I've had some that have been like literally no point in lubing and then I've had some that are like did you put lube on these and you really it's pretty random which you get okay so here's why this case is annoying here's why this case is annoying I have to use a keycap puller and pull every keycap off of the case like that's so annoying just give me like, at least with a tray, that's annoying. Like, it's not definitely the end of the world. You've had these keycaps for three weeks. I've had these keycaps for a very long time and just never gotten around to it, Sviz. It's kind of annoying. Like they've just been sitting on my shelf. I think they've fallen over a couple times. But, you know, same with this keyboard. I think I had this keyboard back in February um, and just, I was gonna build it and then things came up and then I was gonna build it and then things came up and I was gonna build it and then things came up. But because this is not cherry profile, the north facing LEDs have, there's no po uh, point to be stressing about it. So that's good. No interference here. Which, you know, GMK overrated anyways, but there's cherry profiles that aren't GMK, like Infinikey. This is a GK68XS. Kaluzia, hello. EpoMaker sent this out with the keycaps. They also sent me 10 Gateron yellow switches to build it out with. 10. Yeah, I said GMK overrated. I said it. But that's my preference, man. That's my preference. This is a hobby of preference. I'm doing alright, Kaluzia. I'm doing alright. I've got the PBT Toby prototypes behind me that I want to open. I've got a board in front of me that I want to see how it sounds. You know? It is what it is. I mean, okay, so... A lot of what GMK is good for is the designers that happen to work with GMK to get their designs on GMK, 
right? But if those same designs were done in not GMK, they would look just as cool. You know, that's all I'm saying. Like, uh, you know, if we actually got Olivia colors on this profile, that'd be pretty dope. Unfortunately, these aren't Olivia colors. Uh, and they're kind of weird, but they're not a clone, so that's good. Smoky yellow Telios. Obviously, these are smoky yellow Telios. Duh. These are ASA. Reconix. They are ASA. Or Asa. Um, IFK quality control is fine. It's TKC quality control and color matching. I mean, literally, it was a set. It was like four sets in a row, and then they committed to fix it in the future. Um, all I'm saying is keep an eye out for some future TKC stuff and IFK stuff. They have committed pretty hard to resolve those issues. Granted, their blog post that they put out about it was so long that I feel like nobody read it, and rightfully so. But the, the things they're doing to fix it, I think, will be good. Now, full disclosure, I am working with them to make a set. So I can't really talk about some stuff. But just based on what I'm seeing them do publicly... I think that's uh, it's gonna be pretty good. Yeah, I think it'll be good. Oh, I put the cue on sideways. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> that's not the cue. That's not the there. That's not the set's fault. I'm get. I'm trying to read chat. Cue. Oh, okay, shut up, chat. Reconix, welcome to the watering hole gang again. It's great to have you back. Now you have a cool little badge next to your name. I'll drink some water in your honor, Reconix. Welcome, welcome. Great to have you back. You too can join the Watering Hole Gang by typing exclamation point join. If we get eight more members, I'll show off my PBT Toby prototypes. And you better join fast, because the stream will be ending soon enough, honestly. The badge is different now. You've got your two-month badge. So, thank you for that. Wait a second. Did they fit a tilde on here? Did I put the whole top row on wrong? Ugh. I can't believe I've done this. Also, I bent so many pins. I feel like half of this board won't work. Yeah, I am making a keycap set and finicky delight through and finicky. Um, I'll have updates on that pretty soon, actually. Tilde's next to backspace. Yeah, I freaking knew it. All right. Oh, heck and heck. So now I will remove all of these keycaps that I just put on the top row, and then add the tilde. Next to backspace. I actually hate when boards do that. It's one of my least favorite layouts is a tilde next to backspace. Ah, Snazzle. Welcome to the watering hole, gang. It's great to have you here, Snazzle. Let me drink some water in your honor. Welcome, Snazzle. There we go. Um, if anyone else wants to join Snazzle, we are only seven members away from showing off the PBT Toby super ultra scuffed prototypes so i'll show off my scuffed prototypes of a keycap set that i'm making if we get seven more members by the end of the stream you can become a member by exclamation point join i guess so anyways let me put these back on and welcome snazzle uh yeah so making pbt toby has been a bit of an adventure um Mostly because I'm trying to find my factory and everything myself rather than working with like a vendor. Just because I think it's more informative and fun. And I'd like to make a guide so other people could do it in the future. Um, which I think would be cool. But a uh, 
you know, like a, uh, a problem with that is I don't have like a working relationship with these factories. They send out scuffed prototypes. You know, it is what it is. Like their color matching has been quite bad, which is frustrating. There. There we go. Boom. I just can't picture paying 200 retail for ABS. I have, I have, I'm not proud of it. Well, like 150, not 200, but you know, it's similar. There we go. There's my magic. Thank you, your videos are what got me into building keyboards and now the reason I have the keyboard I have right now. Ah, that makes me happy, Snazzle. Okay, so here's what I hate about these. So, these stupid pluses lock in your keycaps and the only way to really remove a keycap is with a puller like that. Otherwise you're fricked. That's what I was complaining about the whole time. So, yeah. There we go. So that's the struggle. But the box is like, it's acceptable enough. And I can seal her back up. Although, there's a good chance I want to just disassemble this, honestly. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Eesh. Yeah, white alphas would have been way better for this. So let me get a couple bits of B-roll. Let me get a couple bits of B-roll and I'll get my thoughts on it as I get my couple bits of B-roll for the video. If you're new to a Hippio Tech stream, you know that I delay the sound tests as long as possible, just to tease. So you're gonna get teased for a little bit. Where did I get my prototypes made? I got them made from a factory in China and uh, they tried their best. I took a little sneak peek and I went, eh. And uh, you two can go, eh, if we get seven more members by the time I'm done with this stream, which I'll probably be done in 15 to 20 minutes at this rate, but we'll see. Yeah. I don't understand. I'm from Argentina and I don't speak English. Well, hello. I hope you're doing well. Yeah, I mean, it's clean. i not the biggest fan of those. Uh, gifting members needs to be a thing. I might start setting like straight number, like point goals or something, which would allow people to like donate in to reach those goals rather than just doing member goals or like joining goals. Um, so that way, like, if somebody donates $4, then it counts the same as, or $5, it counts the same as if somebody joined, you know, that type of thing. I have considered streaming on Twitch. I'm not the biggest fan of the platform. Um, the pink is not really that pale. Let me see if the white balance will fix. Let me see if it'll, if it'll calibrate at all. No. It's like slightly more salmon-y in person. Slightly more salmon-y. And I, I'm not the biggest fan of the salmon actually compared to like, yeah. I don't know. I don't like salmon as a color that much.
I think I'm also not the biggest acrylic person. Yeah. So let me get this nice little shot right here. Y'all see that garbage cable management? I'm so sorry. Look at that garbage cable management. I don't have any thoughts on the Phantom 87. Damn it! I have to delete this. Yeah, it's really, it's more salmon than pink. On my stream, it's kind of showing up really flat. Which, yeah. It's, eh. It's me. Oh, you'll be picking up the Sun 68 Reckonix. My full video on it will be out um maybe wednesday maybe wednesday we'll see ah hit marker 9000 welcome to the watering hole gang it's great to see you here drink some water in your honor sound test what's that Oh, sorry, uh... Oh, you want a sound test, do you? Oh. Sucks. Oh. Thank you, hit marker. Kelf. I got paid today, you get paid today. Love the channel, now what's your preferred board size? Well, thank you, I appreciate the $5. Um, my preferred board size is 75%. I am a massive 75% simp. Uh, I really like 75%. I think 75% is the best layout. Um, it's just objectively the best. It's not preference. It's just fact, you know. That's sarcasm, by the way. For those of you that aren't aware what sarcasm is. Okay, let me do this, like there, get some good shine on them. There. So for PBT keycaps, these are pretty shiny. Um, the texture is more similar to GMK, honestly. Yeah. 75% is not a TKL. No, a TKL is an 80%, if I'm not mistaken. Whoa, Joseph. Holy cannoli. Coming in with the $40 super chat. Are you a 40s, are you a 40s uh, user with the $40? Or are you just dropping the $40? Oh no, it said 40% gang rise up. Well, thank you very much, Joseph. Um, I'm going to pretend that I love 40% now for just a second. Wow, 40%. You know, I love I love getting rid of all my keys. Here I go. F row, I don't need it. Arrow keys, I don't need it. Happiness, I don't need it. Give me the 40%. Yeah, there we go. Well, thank you, Joseph. I appreciate it. There we go. Alright, this might be my last B-roll for a little bit. The function row is so useful for so many productivity tasks. And I don't like using macro layers very much. Especially with how many keyboards I have to go through. It's like, ugh. Oof. 
It's an oof. There's your RGB, gamers. There you go. What do you think? Unironically use 40% daily. You program and use sysadmin work. That's interesting. 40% as a daily driver. Do you use like an ergo 40% or do you just use a normal 40%? What, uh, what board is your choice? Like what's your poison? Yeah, here's your RGB. Honestly, this board's RGB is kind of stinky. It's very bright, but it's got it in really just weird positions. Like, you see that? It's on the bottom. Yeah, so it's, uh, it's okay. Not my favorite. You're the 1% gang. Yeah, I only, I actually type with one key. That's just the best way to type, honestly. Best way to type. Okay. So, I think I need a thumbnail picture. Which... Oh, not my foot. No foot pick yet. You have four planks. And use them mostly, but you've got a few. Let's split. JD40 clone. And a minivan. Woo. So many. 40% gang. Forty percent gang is very peculiar. I appreciate them for their dedication. But a little bit peculiar, you know? I gotta get the top down RGB. Oh, you want a sound test? Hmm. You know what? If we hit the 110 members, maybe I'll do a sound test, you know? But like, for right now, I'm happy taking B-roll. I'm, I'm getting work done. I'm chatting. I'm having a great time. You can tell my camera's pretty low battery. That looks really bad. Just one key. I bet. Oh, you poor things. That's probably gonna be my thumbnail picture. Or maybe this. Wait. Probably that. They're like, they're green gray. They're green. They're green. Ah, Kelf. Welcome to the watering hole gang. I appreciate you. I hope you're doing well. I'll drink some water in your honor. Make sure you hydrate. All right. All right. Hi, Justin. It's great to see you here again. Yeah, it's it's a green gray. It's a green gray. So like, it's a gray that sits at a very greenish tinge. It's hard to describe. Yeah, so there you can see the curve of the keycaps on the board. For the price, I think they're pretty solid. They're the same thickness as GMK. They've got a couple defects, but they're half the, oh, more than half the price of GMK on average. Um, 
Yeah. All right. So, a couple people wanted sound tests, but I think I'm only at 105 out of 110 for the goal or something like that. I think a couple people might need to join. The RGB just looks grungy. Yeah, I, it, I'm not a fan of this overall. They're not as clear on the legends? Yeah, they are. Like, let me grab a GMK legend. Are you intoxicated? Um. Oh, sorry, that's at different heights. There. No, my autofocus won't do it justice. Here. Let's do this. They'll sit at slightly different heights, so it won't be perfect. Um, but yeah, I'll do a sound test at 110 members. Why not? Let me troll. Just a little bit. But yeah, Legend, Legend Clarity. It's... They're literally identical in clarity. These are just thinner than GMK. Um, like, I mean, just in, in like, aesthetic quality, GMK looks like bad quality compared to this with the perfectly clean double shot process. Look at GMK's sloppy lines and... Oh, man. But, you know... Professional GMK hater, by the way. Not an actual GMK hater, but... I do think GMK needs to improve a lot of stuff. The assumption that they're just the default superior quality keycap is... I think a silly notion with how much you pay for them. But I digress. They're both pretty shiny, honestly. But this is PBT, rather than ABS. Ah. CRP is the best. I've heard CRP getting pretty hyped recently. I don't. I haven't tried CRP. I think I might make this video like more about these keycaps than hmm more about the keycaps than about the board. I think the board is uninteresting. And the more that I fiddle with these keycaps, I think the keycaps are very interesting. keycap set this is it's in the description you could click it in the description these are ASA keycaps similar to SA but not quite I wish I had SA keycaps to compare these two but unfortunately I sold my SA keycaps because I really didn't like them why must plastic rectangle make wallet sad let me tell you just wait till you hear about metal rectangles They'll make your wallet even more sad, honestly. Hey, Ghosta. This is kind of a fun angle. 
Honestly, this this case looks super scuffed. That's a bit of a scuff. If you want to hear Thok, you can go check out some of my other videos, you know. I'm just here to troll you. It is what it is. Brass Rectangle also kills Wallet. That's very true. Um, the the ones in the description, if they say black, pink, that's these. You know? Yeah, it's the, I think it's machined. I can't really tell if it's machined. Hmm. But I, I reckon this board is not worth the money. Uh, I think that's going to be the final conclusion of my video. For the board. I think if you're really desperate, then the normal GK68 would be fine enough. They're obviously black and salmon, but salmon is a type of pink. How tall are you? For every inch, I'll give you a dollar. Hey Google, what's five foot 11 in inches? Hey Google, what's five foot 11 in inches? What? I said 511. Hold on. 71? Thank you. Thank you, chat. You're better than... Why do I even have a robot when chat can tell me? 71 inches. All right. So there you go. I raise you $71. Have fun donating. Good luck. Um, the renders do look better. I agree. I don't think these look terrible in person, though. Honestly. Uh, okay. Anyways. I should have gotten Alexa. Damn it. You were right the whole time. I activated your voice recognized locked Google Home. And that's fantastic because I didn't even activate mine properly. What the hell? What's going on, Google? Mm. In real life, these are not very similar to Olivia. They are much more salmon. Much more salmon. Yeah. If you're getting these expecting an Olivia clone, I mean, number one, shame or whatever. But number two, they're not Olivia. They're not. It, they're, they just ain't. That ain't it. Well, um, let me just bring out, you guys want to see something I've been working on for a little bit? You guys want to see a top secret thing that I've been working on for a little bit? I know we have the Toby goal, but I kind of want to show it off. Hmm. Hmm. Top secret thing. Oh, a couple people said no. All right, I guess I don't need to show it off then. Okay. Anyways. Hold on, uh, I'll be right back. Here, let me just keep it out of focus. That way you can't see it. Oh, my white balance went insane. What the hell?
Anyways, it's a mouse pad. Um, I personally really, 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 really like it. I don't know why my white balance is so off. Let me fix this. Okay, I'd say that's the closest. My white balance is always green. Um, oh, oopsie. That's why my thing was doing that. So, a quick preview of it. This is a pixel art desk mat that I had commissioned. And you will be able to buy it in a month or two, probably two months. So this is a prototype. It's based on my photography. This looks insane. Great job, man. Keep up the streams. Thank you, Cyborg. I appreciate it. But yeah, this, I absolutely love this. I love pixel art. You can see the detail is like exquisite. Super, super nice. The color's also awesome. Um, very, very stoked on this. Super ultra stoked. And yeah, so this will be going on Kinetic Labs sometime in the future. Um, you'll be able to buy it from Kinetic Labs sometime in the future. Been working with them. This is a prototype. This is a prototype. It's not 100% indicative of what the final version will look like, but I'm very stoked with it. I'm very, very, very happy with it. Very happy with it. Mr. K, welcome to the watering hole, gang. I appreciate you. Great to see you here. Let me drink some water in your honor. So if you guys are interested about this desk mat, if you guys want more info about this desk mat, I, this is the first time I've ever showed it off publicly, even the design. So congratulations. You got an exclusive first look just by being here on the Hippio Tech stream. Isn't that fun? Isn't that fun just being here and getting an exclusive first look on a product? How many people have desk mat prototypes before they've even revealed the design? Yeah. Anyways, you were here. If you want more info, join my Discord, exclamation point Discord. I will post some eventually. No, it's not fun. You're not fun. Yeah. What are the dimensions? The dimensions are standard to Kinetic Labs desk mats. So let me check. Let me double check. Oh, actually. You know what desk mat is now live on Kinetic Labs? A ton of them. Not this one, but there's a ton of desk mats live on Kinetic Labs right now. Um, so make sure you click the link down in the description to check out Kinetic Labs desk mats. They're 900 millimeters by 400 millimeters. So please check out the link in the description if you want to see desk mats similar to this. eBay's mat is now up. Yeah, add me on eBay's mat is now live on Kinetic Labs. Um, so that's cool. I heard you guys wanted a, a sound test. Did you guys actually want a sound test or were you just trolling me? Oh, people want a sound test. Okay. All right. Well, maybe I'll give you one. 
Um, so, warning. Warning. Sound test warning. I have not lubed any of these stabilizers. These stabilizers are whatever the factory gave me. If the stabilizers suck, it's the factory's fault. Um, and that is what it is. Okay. Yeah. So if the sound test is bad, there you go. The amount of people that cannot read the description is incredible. It's incredible. You guys passed at least... You have to be 13 to watch. be watching the stream, right? You're at least 13. You can at least read. I believe in you. I believe in you. Please. Come on. I know the, like... You're not all American, right? I know the American education system sucks, but like... Why are we here? Just to suffer? You better be careful. If you say you're 12, I'm legally obliged to ban you. Um, anyways. I'm disappointed. But let me go to... Oh! I think I need to open VIA. And, uh, and test for bent pins, actually. Before I do a type test. Because... There are some bent pins afoot. Let me do my key tester. You're two years old? Yeah, we already knew that. Okay, so T doesn't work. I repeat, T doesn't work. Um, if you have specific keyboard build questions, feel free to join my Discord and ask around in there. Um, yeah. Feel free. Feel free. Alright. Um, don't mind me, I'm just fixing bent pins. Because they're bent. Wait. There we go. I wonder if these have interference on north facing LEDs. Yeah, I just unbend them to fix them. I unbend them with usually a pair of tweezers. I find that that tends to work the best for me. Here, let me show you. Here's a bent pin. So I remove the keycap, then I remove the switch. And this is mighty bent. So I just take my little pliers or tweezers and I straighten it out. Sometimes if it's curled, you have to stick it in and then like kind of unbend it in stages if you've really messed it up. There's various degrees to bent pins. This one's probably one of the the baddest. But you should technically be careful with bent pins. Because otherwise you might pop out a hot swap socket. Alright. This board is just loud and proud and I don't think very good. Okay. I heard you guys wanted a type test. So I'll give you a type test. Um, let me mute my music. Music is muted. Let me pull up the type test. Let me go to Firefox. Type test dot... I, uh... Caps lock is on. Okay. So I think I need to make this full screen. Yeah. Now it shows up. Ladies and, and gentlemen, and seven-year-olds that can't read... The moment you've all been waiting for. The type test on not a very good keyboard. I like typetest.io the best. So that's what I use. Thank you. 
Okay. Anyways. Let me turn off my fan. I gotta do another one. I gotta do another one. I feel like there's a broken key. But I think it's just... I'm not used to typing on this profile. Um, so let me do... Let me do one more. Redo. Redo. No! Okay, redo. What? Okay. Um, oh, you know what? I'll do one more simply because I forgot to do the stabs right at the end. So we're doing one more. If you want to know the board, type exclamation point build. We're doing one more test. Oof. Those stabilizers are pretty trash. Besides the backspace. The backspace sounds great. Everything else? Yikes. Not the worst. Not the worst. But yikes. Um, you know? Yikes enough. So, overall, we built this board today. And it's an interesting board. It's an interesting board. Ah, Kelf. Opinion on Franken switches. I recently made a set using Gat Red Ink housings and Gat Silent Black stems and 100 gram springs. Ooh, super heavy, super quiet. I think Franken switching is interesting, but not economical. Um, I think if you enjoy having fun Franken switching, that's great, and you should keep doing it. But I personally don't Franken switch much. Um, it's really hard to, like, convey Franken switches from a creator standpoint because there's just so different than something that people can easily get access to. So I tend to avoid Franken switching. But I think it's cool. Shubes Franken switches a lot. I love Shubes. Shout out Shubes. Mm -hmm. 
uh, go sub to Shubes if you're not subscribed to Shubes. But yeah, so Franken switching is interesting, but it's just not my forte. But thanks for the five, Kelf. So, okay. The board is done. The build is done. You guys have witnessed it. I showed off my super top secret desk mat that I'm developing that will be on Kinetic Labs in a month or two. So stay tuned for that. And you know what? We're four members away from showing off my scuffed PBT Toby prototypes. So, you know, I'm going to be honest with you guys. I, I have about five minutes left on stream. If we don't get four joins, then I can't show off the PBT Toby prototypes. So, you know what to do. The only way to save the stream and show off my PBT Toby prototypes is to join. We need four more people to exclamation point join. Yeah, that's what we need. I call my newest set Invisible Ink. That's interesting. That sounds interesting. So yeah, if we get four more members in the next minute or two to get our goal or whatever, then sure, I'll show off my PBT Toby prototypes. If not, that's fine. Um, I'll go about my merry day, you know? I got work to do anyways. It's all right. This particular set of keycaps is not really a clone of anything, honestly. They have clone sets on their website. A lot of Akko sets are clones. I don't support those inherently as a designer. These are Vimoto headphones. These are M100s. Thanks for noticing. Um, but yeah, we got four more. Look, I'll show them. This box isn't the, it's not the PBT Toby designed box, but I do have those that I can show you. Um, I have the AK-84S, but they sent it to me with optical blue switches, so they don't really get a review, I guess, because it's optical blue. It's kind of gross. Yeah, so this, these are the PBT Toby prototypes. I took one sneak peek at them to make sure they were the Toby prototypes. They're kind of scuffed, but we'll check them out together. You know, we could. We could check them out together. Or we could not check them out together. We still need four members. Only you can support PBT Toby being shown on stream. By Hippio Shill Tech. Ah, there's one. Also, Bart, thank you so much for the CZK50. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Lauren. Lauren Alba. Welcome to the Watering Hole Gang. Great to have you here. That means we're three away. We're three away. Here, let me just put this really big on stream. There. Yeah, so we're three away. And I'll open this box and I'll show you. And I'll spend an extra five minutes on stream showing you. An extra little time. I was wondering if you've heard of Oreo switches and your thoughts on them. I've heard of them, but I don't have thoughts on them. Well, it's great to have you here, Lauren. Let me drink some water in your honor. Hmm. Yeah. But, you know, we're three away. We're three away. We've got this box. Three exclamation point joins away. I could tease a little bit. Ooh. Ooh, we're teasing. Ooh. 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 I'm pretty hydrated. Yeah. If you join the watering hole gang, I drink water in your honor. Um, out of my water bottle. I've got cute little hippie tech stickers on it. Um, so yeah, if you want me to stay hydrated, you know, you gotta, I guess, join or whatever. I don't know. We're an extra shield today. These are keycaps. These are keycaps that I've developed um, these are my second prototype of the keycaps. I reckon they're scuffed. Um, they're pretty scuffed. Yeah. I wonder. Oh! Kyle Johnson! Kyle Johnson! Welcome to the Watering Hole Gang. Oh my god! It's great to have you here, Kyle. Let me drink some water in your honor. 
and Carson. Carson Whitmore. Welcome to the Watering Hole, gang. It's great to have you here. Let me drink some water in your honor. It's freaking great. Um, have you seen the W H I 65? I haven't. No. Um, maybe post a picture in the members only chat in discord after you link your link your discord and your YouTube, and then you'll get access to the members only chat in discord. That's where you get a lot of your exclusive perks, like where I post behind the scenes content and just fun stuff. I just kind of chat with members a little bit more. Um, so yeah, all of you that just joined today, make sure you do that. Make sure you link your Discord and YouTube. And then of course, join my Discord. But it's great to have you here, Kyle and Carson and Lauren and all of you. That means we've got one member. We just need one more. Who's going to do it? Who's going to do it? I can show you my terrible keycaps. I know you want to see them. I know you want to laugh at them. A world premiere. Another world premiere. Um, this keycap set does have the smaller right shift. Yeah. Another world premiere. Um, if you want a sound test of this, then you could go back and check the VOD. Um, or watch the final video, I suppose, when it's out. But yeah. Oh, there we go. Bone Dog XX. Oh, and Joseph upgraded. Whoa. All right, Bone Dog XX, welcome to the Watering Hole Gang. It's great to have you here. I will drink water in your honor. Joseph, thank you for upgrading. It's freaking super great to have you in the group by Guardians. Let me drink some water in your honor. I'm gonna be so hydrated, I'm gonna be peeing quite a lot. Thank you for supplying my pee source. So, awesome, we hit the goal. Thank you so much, you guys. This mouse pad will be on Kinetic Labs, it's, mo it's mine. It's my mouse pad. My mouse pad. I commissioned this artwork. Isn't that great? Anyways, I know you wanted to see this. So let me show you the scuffed prototypes. Oh, that's very bright. Why is that so bright? Ah. And the white balance is off. Hold on. Hold on. I think that's better. All right. I will be selling the mouse pad for $24.99. I think, maybe just 24. So, everybody say hi, Toby. Everybody say hello, Toby. Hello, Toby. Hi. Hello. So as you can see, the yellow has been greatly fixed. The green is actually green. The black, get this, it's black. And the cream is a little bit more cream than I'd like, honestly, but it's fine. It's adequate, it's, it's calming flesh tones. It's what I was going for with the set. The nose is looking so exquisite. The beard. Still a little bit splotchy, to be honest with you. But Toby says hello. Also. So I guess just for anyone that's wondering, this is my keycap set, PBT Toby. It's a meme set. It shouldn't exist. But it does. Congratulations. I don't know what's going on here. Um, this space bar is just the wrong color. I think what they accidentally did is they gave me... Yeah, they did. Oopsie. They they gave me a space bar that was nose colored instead of alpha colored. So I have a beard space bar. And then... That's scuffed. Yeah, that's pretty scuffed. But I, I actually... I have a... The space bar from the other... Should work. But yeah, so this is the face. That's the Toby face. 
and then these are some of the extra keys. As you can see, with this set, even though it's a, a meme face set, like a meme face set, I do include the normal keys. And I actually, I kind of really do like this set as far as actual colors go. Because you've got really pleasing flesh tones on all of the keys as well. Oh yeah. And then, I don't know what's going on actually with this E and I that are just so much bigger than normal. At least I think they're just so much bigger than normal. Oh no, that's normal actually. I think, I think that's normal. It just looks weird because it's next to the five. But yeah, so they got the color matching better this time, but you know what's not better, I think? Let's scope out some of the, uh, some of the keys. Well, that they're doing better. They're still lightening towards the top. Now, I can inspect a lot of these and some are worse than others. Some are fine. Like that's fine. Um, I don't think that's something most people would care about. But yeah, these are cherry profile. Um, they're, I think they're, let me check the thickness on them. I'll check the thickness for you guys. Since I have my calipers out. So what did we check on the others? We compared the GMK was 1.4 on the bottom arrow right here. Okay, so they're about 0.1 millimeters thinner than a GMK keycap. So that's 132. These are Daiso. That's correct. They're Daiso. I could have gotten them double shot, but it would have been a very expensive process, I think. Double shot's only really cheap when mass produced it seems, from talking to these factories. Okay, so InfiniKey is like 141. So it's about 0.1 millimeters thicker than the, inf or thinner, sorry, thinner. So, you know, as far as legend visibility goes, it's not quite in finicky standards. It's just fuzzier. Granted, it's kind of rude to compare the two. I, I did go with thicker legends on everything but it is just fuzzier. This is PBT Toby. This is PBT Toby. Uh, versus, I was comparing Infinity Key Cafe. Um, so yeah, PBT Toby. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Is this up to standard? Is this purchasable? Does this look cute enough for a set? Are the colors good? Are the colors not good? Is this ugly? Yes. Kind of ugly, but also kind of cute. Look at the nose. These colors are actually pretty close to what I wanted, honestly. Yeah, let's check out, good idea, Kaluzia. Let's check out the dark keys. Actually though? 
Let me see if any are the worst. That's pretty good. Granted, I would imagine their quality control would not be this good. But that's pretty good. That's, uh, yeah. That's not bad. So let me, for those of you that are new to the PBT Toby saga, let me bring in some references. You guys paid for this, you know? You signed up as a member, you paid for this. Let me show you some more content. I'm here for you. I was gonna end the stream 20 minutes ago, but you know what? More content for you, stick around, hold on. More content. Okay, so for reference, it's reference time. This is the original box. This is what the packaging will look like for PVT Toby. It is scuffed. I made it when I was drunk in 40 minutes. It is graphic design at its finest. Every box will include a picture of Toby's face on the box and then PBT Toby. This was the original prototype set. Um, just for reference. So they messed up the green really bad on the original. They actually just messed up almost everything on the original prototype set. And I'll show you next to the built board. But yeah, so this box will be the final packaging with that styrofoam, uh, the styrofoam to hold all the keycaps. So, I mean, you're getting actually decent packaging. Um, sourcing the packaging was kind of frustrating, but this is the packaging. PBT Toby, Hippiotech, X Barrett Creative. Hi, hello, yeah, Toby's face. And then, so here is the original PBT Toby prototype set versus the, here's the two. So the only thing I'm unsure about is the alpha color. You like the OG green? I really don't like the OG green. It is too dark, it's almost black. It's almost black. So I changed up all of the legending I submitted like literally a whole new file for the legending. You like the right one? What? You like this one? I think the yellow on this is awful. The green on this is awful. The black looks like gray. Whereas this, you get actual green and you get calming flesh tones. Like, let's just compare the yellow accents real fast. Where's my keycap puller? There it is. Okay, so just to compare the yellows, I really like the pastel yellow more. This is what I was aiming for, and this is what they gave me with the first proto. So those are your, there's your yellow comparison. So top is old, bottom is new. And then let me give you a comparison of the greens. I have this on my cyberboard, by the way. Okay. So, here's the greens. Which, it's hard to even call it a green. It's more of like a black. So, top is... Top is old, bottom is new. Okay. 
Like, I went through a, a pretty lengthy process to make sure these prototypes turned out at least decent. They're not perfect. I'd, I'd say the quality here is below Infiniki. Like, for sure. Being fully transparent, it's below Infiniki quality. And that's why I think for pricing, I'll probably go with something like 69. Because the meme number is funny. Um, and it depends. I might actually change factories again. I might change factories again. Now here's... They have been busting butt to make these. Here's something I'm a little bit intrigued about. Is which you like more between these two. So, top is old, bottom is new. I think the bottom more represents a skin tone, whereas the top just is a little bit less overwhelming. The bottom is calming flesh tones. The top is, hmm. Oh, that is pretty split, actually. I might have to put out a poll in Discord or something. The top does look more gray, for sure. And Toby's a, he's a white dude, you know? He's a pretty peachy, creamy dude. So I don't think the top quite represents Toby. Show with the new green? Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just do what you want. I'm not making this set for, like, you know. I, I, people in my Discord want this set. So that's the new green. Yeah, I, I think I kind of agree, Kaluzia. It, the bottom is like what I was going for with the set. Like what I kind of was looking at with the renders. The top is inoffensive, but this set is inherently offensive. So, do I want inoffensive? Maybe not. Maybe not. Color match to the packaging. Well, um, I mean, this packaging, they actually did get the color correct. Granted, it's hard to show, but they got the color pretty accurate. Do I put this on a board? Do I put this on my cyber board? Right now? Or do I wait? I haven't eaten lunch. Hmm. I have not eaten lunch yet. Do I order lunch? Hold on. I need lunch. Is Joseph funding my lunch again today? Possibly. At this point, Joseph provides me with wonderful sandwiches and I provide him with subpar entertainment. That's a great deal. Okay. Get a pizza with fresh pineapple and ham? I could make a pizza. Hmm. Hmm. It's three o'clock and I haven't eaten lunch. Yeah, it's three o'clock and I haven't eaten lunch. So my food could be here in 30 minutes, but it'll cost me $16. Whew. Hmm. Oh yeah, um, that's a good catch, Panos. So originally with the set, I wanted to go with a brown font color, but I decided to go with black as I just thought it looked better overall. 
Um, I never redid renders to reflect that. Like originally I was gonna have this brown as the font color, but I just thought it looked odd. So I just went with black. Yeah, but good catch. Yeah, I'm gonna go make a pizza. You know what? I'm gonna go make a pizza. If you guys somehow stick around until after my pizza's in the oven, then maybe I'll build out PBT Toby for you. Um, hold on. Let me let me edit the the title of my video, so then I can build up some hype. Okay. So, there we go. I'm gonna go put a pizza in the oven, um, and then I can show off the PBT Toby prototypes. Hold on one second. Second, one second. Um, okay, I'm gonna go put a pizza in the oven, and then afterwards, I will build out PBT Toby. Uh, putting a pizza in the oven will only take me 10 minutes, and then it'll take roughly 12 minutes to cook, and then I'm gonna eat. But I'll be back and forth through that, so don't leave. Um, I'll probably be back here in maybe six minutes, something like that. So stick around.
Wow, I'm very impressed that uh, a lot of you have stuck around. So for that, great to see you still here. Who's still here? If you're still here, hello, say hello. Uh, let me go back to my, there we go. Oh, you know what, let's go to this one for a minute. Let me give you a full camera view, why not? Ah, oh, so many good, friendly faces. I hope you like the music. Turn it down a little bit. Ah, oh, good to see you here, hit marker. Good to see you here, Clusia. Hello, a bird. Hello, a, a tells. Hi, planetary and Dutch. Um, the pizza's not done yet. It's just in the oven. It's just in the oven. Yeah, this is my cyberboard. Um, this is what I was keeping PBT Toby on, and I am going to swap it out 
Um, hold on. Okay. So let me do a little bit of just promotion. Let me do a little bit of promotion here. Post some pictures before I get building. So there we go. All right, here, you can see my Instagram. Building out PBT Toby second prototypes on stream right now. YouTube.com slash C slash Hippio Tech. Hold on. ah, Toby's freaking Snapchat popped up and made my thing go. There we go. All right, there we go. So yeah, the pizza's in the oven, and I'm waiting on the pizza, which will be good. Um, I have a question for you, sir. What's up, Bobby? What's up, Bobby? Hi, I'm from Florida. Hello. 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 Okay, so I do have to disassemble my cyberboard, which currently has the old PPT Toby on it. The old Toby. And my poor box, honestly. Poor thing. All right. So, I don't really need this much. Hello, hello, it's Tasha. Huh. Hey, Tasha. Top of the morning to you, Tasha. Hi, Music Easel Cat. Hi, Eli. Who is Toby? That's a great question. And for that, I have one thing to show you. All right? One thing to show you. It's me, Hippiotech here. It's coming at you live with the Gateron Yellows. Please join down below. <laughs> Please support the channel in any way you can. And uh, i see you next time, gamers. Bye-bye. So there you go. Um, that's Toby. Toby says hi and hello. And that's like Toby's thing. Yeah. Uh, in reality, Toby's just a friend of mine. Um, the meme is Toby was on one of my YouTube videos. He was on a stream with me. Um, he's an avid member of my Discord and Discord moderator. Um, just a member of my community in general. All around good guy. He's a woodworker. Uh, at Barrett Creative is his handle if you want to see some of his woodworking. And the story behind PBT Toby is one night we were in Discord. And, you know, Toby's a funny guy. We all set our profile pictures to Toby. And then we all set our names on Discord to Toby. And everyone was Toby. And everything was Toby. And one of them said, Oh, what if we make Toby a keycap set? That would be dumb, right? And I said, yeah, that would be dumb. That's actually stupid. So then, of course, I went into Blender and made Toby a keycap set. And I was like, yeah, this is dumb. This is actually stupid. Uh, so then I go, okay. And they like, my, the people in my Discord, all the Tobys, said, no, we want this. You need to make this a set. I'll give you my money right now. And I said, this is stupid. I don't like this. But I'll post it to Reddit. And if it gets a thousand upvotes, I'll make it into a set. Well... To be frank with you guys, it got almost 2,000 upvotes, and uh, here I am, spending way too much effort on a shit post with to turn my friend into a keycap set. Yeah, ex I, why? Great question. 
So therefore, Toby is everyone. We are all Toby. Um, what case material do you like the most? Probably polycarbonate. But I do really like aluminum as well. Um, acrylics, okay. I tend to have some issues with acrylic from time to time. Did that just bend? No. Um, oh, hi, Toby. Toby, come, come over and build this real fast. Is Toby on the way? Hey, do you guys want to see Toby on the stream building this? I can get this disassembled and then have Toby actually build it. Granted, it would be a lot of effort to have Toby come all the way over here just to put the keycaps on the keyboard. But if Toby's down for it and you guys want it, we could have Toby on stream. That would be legendary. Who wants Toby on stream? We need to put this in the chat. Do you want Toby on stream in person? Chat, let me know. I don't want to see no inactive chat. I want to see... Do you want Toby? I was only nine years old. I love Toby so much. I had all the merchandise and keycap sets. Do you want Toby on stream? Tell me right now, you little fricks. Should Toby come over? Pizza party with Toby? Oh. I honestly probably don't have enough pizza to share with Toby, but I will eat my pizza. All right. You guys want Toby. You want Toby. Maybe we'll have Toby come over. We'll see how fast he can get over here. So I'll probably eat my pizza, and then hopefully he'll be over there by then. Over here by then. All right, I see you, chat. I see you. Si, senor, hippio, quiero, Toby. All right. All right. Oh, yeah, here's how bad the first set of prototypes was. Since you're wondering. Oh, wait, I can't even really. So this factory did a glow up, and I wonder if they'll keep, like, the level of quality for... Because that's really bad. Like, if any of the keycap sets ended up like that, I'd be so mad. I also had to redo the whole design file, though. Yeah. I had to redo the whole design file. I gave them different fonts. Gave them different legending. So, originally, I gave them a design file that's similar to the first. And they didn't use it. <laughs> they didn't use it. Because they said the prototypes were just for, like, coloring and stuff. I was kind of mad. Um, but you know, it is what it is when working with factories, you kind of just gotta be headstrong about everything. The, yeah, it's, it's kind of bad. <sighs> Man, well, my elbows are going to hurt after all this keyboard building. But, you know, it is what it is. We made Toby into a keycap set. Why? I don't know. Hello. For anyone that's just tuning in, my keycap set, PBT Toby, the second round of prototypes has arrived. Because they arrived, Toby is on the way. The Toby from PBT Toby is on the way um, to come put them on a keyboard. So that's exciting. Um, and what I'm doing is I'm currently stripping the old set of prototypes off of this keyboard. And then it'll be ready for Toby. And we can compare the prototypes and, you know, see how bad the factory did originally and that type of thing. Hit marker 9000. Thanks for two bucks. G scale crystal caps or pudding caps. I'm not the biggest fan of puddings, or and I don't know what the crystal caps are, but I think if you just want puddings, go with puddings, you know? Hippio, can you buy the Akko 3098 hot... Ooh, I, I got a burp. Hot swap board, it's only 90 bucks, and comes with the new double shot ASA and Akko CS switches. 
Probably not right now, honestly. Um, I have a lot on my plate and on my schedule as far as builds and boards go. So maybe at some point in the future, I'll check out stuff like that. But like if Akko is to sponsor a video or something, then I would check it out. Like boards like that intrigue me, but I really don't have the budget to be buying stuff right now. Um, and I, I don't have the time as well. What do you think about lubing membrane keyboards? Uh, I wouldn't do it, honestly. It's not really worth the time. Maybe, like, I don't know what membrane stabilizers look like, because I honestly haven't touched a membrane board in generations, but I don't think that's the best idea. Sup, Hippio? Hi, Nick. How are you doing? I've been in the hobby for a year and just finally bought my first keyboard, which will be here in another year. KL90, get hype. Well, I'm sure you'll love the KL90. I loved it so much that I went and picked out a bunch of hardwood yesterday to go build a wooden version with Toby. Um, so I'm going to be building a wooden version, and it's going to be pretty dope. Um, I'm very excited about it, actually. I, I really, like, kind of fell in love with the KL90. The layout took a bit to get used to, and I was very sad I had to send it back. Um, this is the Cyberborn that I'm touching. The Cyberborn. You can check out my review on it if you want. Oh, my pizza timer's up. I repeat, my pizza timer is up. Hold on. I'll answer your questions. I'll be right back. I need to go pull my pizza out of the oven. Please be patient. I'll be right back. You can send all your questions and I'll try and look at them when I get back.
Hello, I have returned. Um, let me go into this. Hello. So I have to not get any crumbs on my new mat because I still need to do good promo photos of this ah, at some point. So I'll get crumbs on this mat. For those of you that have stayed waiting, thank you. I appreciate you. We will have Toby on stream in roughly 12 minutes or 15 minutes. Um, so if you want to see Toby, please wait about 15 minutes and Toby will be on stream. Until then, I have pizza. Um, which, yeah. Pizza! Pizza, pizza, pizza. And hello. How many of you 128 people are actually here? I know a lot of you like to look or lurk, but um, how many of you are actually around? Let me turn on notifications. All right, there's at least four of you. I appreciate you lurkers, but hello. I'm going to eat some pizza now. You know, you guys can chat with each other too. We're a welcoming community. You guys can ask each other how, how your days are going. Bird can be like, hey Liam, how are you doing? And Liam can be like, yeah, Bird, I'm doing okay. Thank you. Oh, you want pizza cam? Okay. Ooh. It's a little bit overexposed. There we go. Who's Toby? Ha! Who isn't Toby? Yeah. So, here's my pizza. Um, for reference, it's just marinara sauce, some cheddar and mozzarella, some chicken, some herbs. I made this. I used um, a sourdough pizza crust and then threw everything on it. Yeah. Yeah, so this is this is homemade hippio pizza. Homemade hippio pizza. Granted, normally I have to preheat the oven, so the crust is very like, kind of scuffed, honestly. It's like New York style right now. Mm. But, mm. Mm. I can't really complain. Pizza sound test. It's kind of mush, honestly. Mm. This is like 7 out of 10. So, just in, in insight into how I do my pizza, basically, I have a pizza stone, I preheat my oven to 450 degrees Fahrenheit, and I leave it preheating for roughly 30 minutes to an hour. That way my pizza stone gets really, 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 really hot. Then, I put my pizza in the oven. That makes it so the bottom crust is super crispy, and it cooks really evenly and it's just delicious. That's just pizza beta. It's, yeah, that would make it better. So because I didn't preheat the oven, I just made this on a whim. Yeah. Oh, that's genius. Mm. I might have to try that a bird. Mm. T-Box, hello. Welcome to the stream. Great to have you here. So right now we're at the um, the pizza intermission, where I am, of course, eating pizza. 
I'm folding it New York style so I can eat it, of course. Um, and then pretty soon here, we're going to have Toby, the Toby, from PVT Toby, come on stream and build the PVT Toby prototypes. Hmm. Um, it's a basic Amazon one, Richard. I think it was like a $20, $30 ceramic one. You need more cheese? Mmm. I usually am pretty tame on the cheese. Because I'm lactose intolerant. And barbecue sauce would have made it better, of course. Mmm. But, you know... Oh yeah, the bottom has no char. So normally my pizzas, if you go back and watch a couple of my streams where I make a pizza and then eat it on stream, normally it's so much more crispy and just delectable. Yeah, barbecue sauce on pizza is amazing. Yeah. If you haven't had that, you're missing out for sure. Barbecue sauce and chicken. Super good. Thank you, Lacia. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Barbecue chicken. So good. I have a barbecue sauce that I can actually eat on the low FODMAP diet, and I really like it. Why do I have... I have a retro trip meme saved on my OBS. Customized mouse build anytime soon. Ooh. Well, thank you for the donation, Fenny. Uh, I think a customized mouse build would actually be pretty fun, but probably not soon. Sometime in the future? Potentially, yeah. Hmm. Um... The manufacturer of PBT Toby's is a random factory out of China. Um, yeah, at least as of right now. Good beginner 60% board? I'd recommend asking that in my Discord. Exclamation point Discord. How's your day been? Been good, actually. Yeah, I really can't complain. Um, my, my freaking elbows and stuff hurt. Like, right here I go complaining. Um, but yeah, not too bad. Uh, what's your daily driver for your keyboard right now? Type exclamation point board. I actually have that laid out for you. Are customized mouse a big thing? I've seen... There's a, a mouse community that's starting to grow. Not as big as the keyboard community, but yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I actually almost always eat food in my room, so... Hmm. I don't know what to tell you. What do you think about the new 2021 Hot Swap RK61? Hmm. I reckon Royal Kledge reached out and they want to sponsor a video. So I will actually take a look at it sometime soon. It will be a sponsored video, but they told me I can say whatever I want. And I really, as I've proven before, I don't care if they give me money. If the board's bad, the board's bad. Mm. Toby's here. I repeat, Toby is here. Mm. All right, I'll be right back. I'm letting Toby in.
Is that Toby? Who's that? Wait. Camera. Hello. Hello, chat. It's Toby. Everyone. 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 It's Toby. Where are they? Everyone say hi to Toby. Where are they? Um, They're in this box right here, which I'll show you. Very soon. Very soon. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hi. Hello. Wow, there's so much Toby hype. So much Toby. I sit here eating pizza, and they're like, <laughs> lame chat. I sleep. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. They're worshipping you. <laughs> Hello, chat. Wow. Hello. Mm. They think you're cute. Oh. The how young dare, tubster. How dare you lie to my face. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Mmm. But yeah, so we've got the cyberboards right there. I have to finish stripping it naked. And then I just have one more piece of pizza to eat. And then we can get going. Mmm. Toby's got his legendary Toby hat on. Pro gamer Toby. Don't listen to that space bar. Oh that space bar. Dude, I don't yeah, know. I didn't I didn't look I didn't look at the color on the front of it yesterday. That yeah. Is, that yeah. is mighty bad. That's, that first set is so bad. Eat that crust, you monster. I'm in a hurry, James. Mm. Yeah, somebody really needs to make a keycap set of Toby. Yeah. I'm surprised no one's done that yet. I mean, come on. Mm-hmm. What, what are you waiting on? Yeah. Untapped market. Untapped. Yeah, but we're going to get the cyberboard naked. Mm-hmm. Toby is Telios? What? It doesn't make sense to me. I don't know what that mm. means, but I disagree. How did you two meet? How do we meet, Toby? Uh, well, I think... How long has it been? 14 years? It's been a long time. It's been a, long it's time. Been a really long time. Um, mm. Yeah, it's been a long time. I think we... I met through, like, one of his, like, older siblings. Mmm, that's um, right. Yeah, because I was friend... I was, like, good friends with your oldest brother. Mm -hmm. And then I just kind of knew you by association. Yeah. Yeah. So we used to do like land parties mm -hmm. randomly. And then I really met Toby when I moved down for college. That's true. And Toby got me into rock climbing. And then I got Toby into keyboards, which yeah, is a really bad trade. That's a pretty bad trade for me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let me just, clean up my workspace. Just destroying that desk mat. I've got so many crumbs. This is why you don't eat on your What's desk kinetic mat. What's Kinetic Lab's gonna think? Yeah, right? Oh no. I'm sorry, Key Bon Bon. Please forgive me. The Wait. GMK Toby Wen. Uh, give it 10 years. Mm-hmm. I lied. I want more pizza. <laughs> <laughs> For breakfast, I have... Did I have breakfast? <laughs> Hold on. It's always a good good way to start off. I don't know if I had breakfast. That might be why I'm so hungry. Mm. When did Toby learn about keyboards? Uh, when, when he forcibly dragged me into the keyboard rabbit hole. Is when, yes, you. No. <laughs> did you see the keyboard I had before this? Mm. 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 It's not, a, not enthusiast grade, I'll tell you. All right, do we just put Toby to work? Let's put Toby to work. Oh, that sounds pressure. Fine. All right. Okay. And then, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pull up the YouTube stream. Hi, right here. streamer Hippio here. How's it going? God, why are you so much more handsome? Than me? That's not fair. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, stream. Okay, there we go. Now I've got two. Toby, chats. you regret it slightly. But not. I don't know. It's one of those things. Sometimes it keeps you up at night. Sometimes you're like, hey, it's pretty pog. You know, yeah. it's whatever. Yeah, it's pog. Oh, right. yeah. you got four? There you go. There we go. Mm. Say howdy hey. Howdy hey. <laughs> That's it. Howdy hey. Tobio, Tobio Tech here. Tobio Tech here. Uh, I like Ida Bow. Hey. Hey. Oh. Hey. 
No, this this keyboard I was building right here earlier. Ooh. Yeah, it's it's pretty, right? That's and SA profile, right? It's good good eye, but it's actually ASA. Oh. It's Echo's proprietary take on SA. Excuse me while I vomit. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's actually slightly better than SA, in my opinion. Um, but that's because it's, it's shorter. You see how it's like, it's not offensively tall. Mm. It's more similar to um, like OEM. Okay. Whereas Cherry is just small. Small. But I'm no. just uh, I'm just not a fan of the the legends mm. on SA. Oh, my battery's off. Oopsie. 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 Toby legit rocking with the Toby cap. Well, yeah. You think yeah. I take this thing off? No. He sleeps in it. He showers in it. I sleep in, in it. it. He uh, does other things in it. You don't, know? Listen, don't listen to this man. Like woodworking. <laughs> on his woodworking account. Uh, Barrett Creative on Instagram. There you go. Don't, for, don't forget everyone to be creative. Oh, that's disgusting, actually. I know. Uh, that's really gross. Um, <laughs> what's your most expensive custom keyboard? Is that a question for me or for, for Hippio? For me, um, it's actually the cyberboard. Yeah. Um, for me, I don't have it yet. But I did buy a Type Master 180 mm. in black gold, so that'll be coming sometime, like September. Yeah, somewhere somewhere around yeah, there. It's probably October. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna build it out with yet, but uh, I suppose we'll find out. Hold on, let me send it at everyone. Toby is live on stream right now. Oh. I'm too strong. I pulled out the switch. Oh, as long as you don't pull out the, uh, the stabilizers, we're good. <laughs> then we can survive. If you pull out the stabilizers, I'm gonna cry. Okay. We're gonna need this. Yeah, we probably don't need this. I don't know where things go. Oh, there they go. Oh yeah, the I'm arrow smart. keys go in there. That's why. I bought they it they go in the arrow key shaped in the slot. Arrow key shaped arrow Because I'm very smart. Of course. Of course. Of course, arrow keys. And then let me just swap cams to. Let's swap cams to full DSLR. Why not? And then let me do. This. Make this a little bit bigger. Here. Toby! That's me. Toby, 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 Toby. 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 Okay, there's your Toby Chan. <laughs> so, this is the old set of PBT Toby. It is shite. Where's the... the, where's the that's, that's your cam. Oh. Just... You might want to hold it over here. Ooh, ooh. There you go. Hey. Yeah, it's confusing, okay. isn't it? This, this space bar is god-awful. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah. Okay, and I'm going to do something behind your back that you're not going to see. Uh-oh. I don't like that. <laughs> Chat, help. Exactly. Help me. Here, just read chat, Toby. Just read chat. Just read chat. How do the new protos look? I'm about to find out. Toby hasn't seen him yet. Why is the space key a pink boy? That's a question for this guy right here. What? What? Someone wants to know why... Uh, you have a Duroc L4 Oh, in for here. some reason, Aqua Kings just don't work. Um, with the... I think I use Morgri stabs. Mm. They just don't work with Morgri stabs on the spacebar. Weird. Um, if I put it in there, it would be really, really... It just wouldn't work. Unless. <laughs> Unless. <laughs> I don't know what it is. You can go watch my cyberboard build stream and see the weird frustration that I had for so long. Okay. Almost. Almost ready. Toby right. does rock climb as well. Uh, I'm the one who got him into it. That's true. That's true. This is the big reveal. Oh, that's right. Look. Who's that guy? Look. Oh my god, is that Oh Toby? my god. Did they stab me again? <laughs> or is this the same box? That's, they they didn't send it. <laughs> okay. I, I did a quick swap behind your back because this is the ah, box that they sent them in. Okay. Which, it's the same box with the same styrofoam and everything, but 
I guess they just didn't want to print another Toby box. You know, that's fair. Considering I didn't pay for the second set of protos. Okay. All right, bigger go for the camera. Get those V motors out of here. Hey. Oh. Oh, Ewan donated and says hello, Toby. Hello, Ewan. Thank you, Ewan, for the five. Well, they certainly look better. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They look way more vibrant. Mm hmm. Nice. It's almost like they're the real colors that they're supposed to be. They do on the space bar. A lot better. A lot better, yeah. It's not perfect. Um, it's like, you can see the color lightning. For yeah. Sure. Yeah, you can really see that here on this, um, on the edge of this. You can see that. That's so oh, weird. Zoom, in. zoom. Enhance. Where is it? There. Hand. You can see, like, right on the tips there. Yeah. Weird. But I think overall it's a lot better. Oh, yeah. This is, like, miles better than the other one. So the... Let me do just we have do a... Oh, yeah, let's oh, just do, like, a side-by-side. -side. Ew is right. So there's a side-by-side. -side. Oh. It's like they sucked out all the color. This is... Uh, Toby when coffee. Toby when no coffee. That's what this... <laughs> <laughs> is this, this is me before I have my morning coffee. <laughs> if you read the lore. Um, but nice. let's see here. If we pull out my Panto books, my $500 worth of paper. Oh. So, the story behind why the colors are so bad, to share with Toby and others who are unaware. Um, can I just set this up like slightly? Oh, I'm gonna fall over. Slightly different. Don't fall over. <laughs> that would be reckless. This so, hippie chair is too weak. So, there we go. So, the story for people that are unaware. This is an uncoated Pantone color bridge. $250 worth of paper. Jesus. <laughs> this is a coated Pantone color bridge. Also $250 worth of paper. Jesus. So, I gave them all of these colors out of this color bridge. Because they told me, hey, we use coated Pantones. Give us coated Pantones for the colors. I did. And you know what they told me? <laughs> they said, oops, sorry, we don't have a coded Pantone book and we matched them to the uncoded book. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, they're basically the same thing. What's a coat, am I right? Yeah, in plastic chips, this would cost roughly $10,000 for sure. So the, if you're wondering what the difference between coded and uncoded is as far as like practical use, um, basically this, the uncoded is on uncoated paper and this is on coated paper. So just the way they absorb ink, the way they display the color, totally different. So there you go. Yeah, we have yucky keycaps versus slightly less yucky keycaps, but still kind of yucky. <laughs> well, that's the goal though, right? I mean, I guess. I guess. <laughs> yeah, I'm curious what your thoughts are. Your what, what on earth is this five? Why is this? That's fair. Um, I think that was a misprint. Okay. Oh, uh, okay. It's supposed to be the unhoming <laughs> five, but they misprinted it. I see. I was gonna say, like, that's not a... Yeah. That's not an option I would take. Yeah, we need Look at the, the ISO. Don't you want all your fives to be like this, chat? Yeah, that's a bit... a bit interesting. Oopsie. Nice. Why are the E and I keys different color? Great observation, Jason. Yeah, um, I'll, I'll explain a little bit about that. As you can see, if you look at my face, I have these two things right here mm -hmm. uh, called eyeballs. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, that's what these are because Very cool, Toby. I have eyeballs. So, you know, the more you know. How does one get a keycap set made and what goes into making one? Great question, Creamy Keys. I will be making probably two full videos on that, honestly. Two full videos. Um, essentially, it's pretty easy, but also very tedious. Um, you find the colors you want, you find a factory to make it. There you go. And then there's a million <laughs> ridiculous steps in between. And then wait three years. And then wait just forever. <laughs> you wait forever. Anyways. So let's nice. put these on the keyboard, eh? Hey. Hey, let's put these on the keyboard. On the hey. keyboard. Put these on a keyboard. I, I, okay. 
So, but yeah, so I, stay tuned to my channel. I'll be making probably two videos on this whole process. <clears throat> when does it drop? That's a great question. I'm honestly just taking my time with this one because I'm so busy with real life. But um, who knows? If we decide to go with this factory, I could have 100 sets made in two months and sell them as in stock or a month and a half or whatever. Um, if we don't go with this factory and we go with a different factory because we don't like the quality, um, check on the darker keys, check the tops to see how the lightning is on some of those. Um, how's that? Doesn't seem that bad. Is it bad at all? I can't really tell. I can't really tell. It honest, I can't right? tell if it's like, it doesn't seem that bad. Um, but yeah, if we don't go with this factory, then it might be another three months, you know. Hippio, I like your shirt. Thanks, E1. Thank you. Um, I just redid all of my merch on my merch store. If you want to check out some of my new merch, some of my new stickers, I've got Yeehaw Designs. Yeehaw. Then uh, do exclamation point merch to check out all my merch. How do the light keys look? Is there lightning on some of them? Yeah, you can see that there. Well, that's pretty bad, actually. Yeah. I don't know how that passed QC. <laughs> QC. What's QC? <laughs> You're a funny one. Um. All right, put some other keycaps on. I'm going to take a picture of this. Send it to the factory. I got to document any of the really bad ones. Oh, well, now everybody wants my money. <laughs> Use the cursed five key. It's disabled, it's gorgeous. You know, Fenny, I think you have a point. <laughs> it's not the right profile for this at all. Yeah, look at that. Don't use the five key. <laughs> Don't, no. No, 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 no. All right. Oh, I pulled the switch. I can't even take a picture of this properly. <laughs> so bad. Alright, we had our fun. How did they mess that up so bad? We got bonked real quick, chat. Ah! Just in the dark. Come on. Okay. Here's your F11 back. Oh boy. It's what I've always wanted. Thank you. Yeah, an F11. <laughs> Congratulations. Congratulations. You've been F. <laughs> 11 times. Yeah, so these are Aqua Kings in my cyberboard. The Blurst 5 will remember. RIP Blurst 5. Remember the 5. Maybe I'll keep it in the set. <clears throat> Maybe. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, Panda's here. Hello, Panda. Hello. Keycaps. I we did model. I matched this color to Toby's skin tone. I did. There's a reason that it looks this way. You know, he really he really went above and I actually, beyond. I matched it to his face skin tone, which is slightly different than his hands and arms skin tone. But it's similar. This is a climbing channel, right? Yeah. Oh, I hope so. Definitely. I might pivot to a climbing channel soon. Petition to revive the Blurst 5 key. <laughs> hmm. You're going to need a lot of petition signatures over there. You're going to need a lot of signatures. So we'll build it out with the scuffed face, and then we'll build it out without the scuffed face. I suppose. I suppose. I suppose. But you know what they did do? Mm. Is they gave me a B-colored spacebar rather than a an alpha-colored spacebar. I wondered what that was. Yeah. It kind of pisses me off. <laughs> um, it's pretty cursed. Where do I sign? Well, you know, I don't know what you're signing, but usually at the oh, bottom of uh, usually at the bottom of documents, oh, that's okay. usually where it is. Yeah. Sign at the bottom by hitting the join button down below. Yeah. Exactly. Um, and yeah, we're pivoting, Sam. We're pivoting hard. 
Say a number. 19. I don't know why are we saying a number. I don't know. What would a Toby sound test sound like? Oh. Ah, the acoustics. Look at these are good acoustics on my Toby. <laughs> wow. Wait, go into the mic and do a really sultry like like really sultry Toby sound test. Come on, Toby. Come on, just Y'all need some bonks. That's him, what I'm give saying. Him some, give him some, That's what I'm saying. Give him a nice a top of the Toby to you. You know, if someone donates five dollars to Hipio, then I'll do it. Ugh. How about that? Hmm. Um, I don't think I put an F13 key in this set. Um, is that, even, I, is that even a thing? It is a thing on some boards, yeah. I put a lot of thought into the kidding, but I really don't care about F13. No, I'm just gonna... I don't have a chair to pull up E1. <laughs> this is my life now. Oh, I could sit right behind Toby. But that might get a little bit scuffed with the, with the microphone. I mean, that's kind of the the game plan here, right? I'm not that scuffed, but I'm still a professional. Professional keyboard YouTuber here. Maybe. Does the microphone cover me? Well, I can't see. Am I in the frame? Uh, yeah. Wow, okay. All right, well, I can't read chat, so I'm gonna have to look at my phone because I'm too blind. <laughs> I swear I'm not a, a zoomer on my phone. I'm looking at chat. <laughs> Maybe. Or am I? You don't know. We're about to hit 45k subs. What the hell? Wow. How? Is that 1k subs in a day? That's pretty nuts. That's more than 1k subs in a day. That's wild. You guys are nuts. I guess you can keep subscribing. Anime you. Phoenix 456. This for you. Stay frosty. Wow. All right. There you go, Anime Phoenix. Thanks for the five. I hold my word. <laughs> if that's all it takes to get money, <laughs> shoot. Sign me up. Sign me up. Oh, man. Where's the... Is my stream not showing up on my phone? Oh, no. That's super weird. Thock voice. Oh, why? <laughs> Toby has a very thocky voice. I don't even know what that means. Uh, bassy. Thok is just keyboard nerd for face, <clears throat> essentially. How warpy is it? Is it warpy? A little. Uh, if you like press a... one side really hard, does the other side pop off? And then like like. No. And try the other side. <clears throat> like. That's pretty good. They did it. They made a space bar work. They made it work. Why am I watching ads on my own video? Uh, support the channel? Cringe. Come on, Hippio. Look, what I'm are in you chat, doing? Guys. Oh, Hippio's in chat. Can we get Pogs wow. in the chat for Hippio? Toby is so cool. I wanna be Toby. You wanna PBT Toby? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was stupid. Uh. Hippio, <laughs> did you climb rocks today? No, actually, like, I keep hurting myself and I'm going on vacation next week. So, I'm trying to be very friendly to myself in how that I climb. So, yesterday I went to the gym and I did physical therapy to try and repair myself. And then, next week I'm going to be climbing outside. So, I'm going to be taking it really easy. Where's the, uh... What are you looking for? Where's the right shift here? Uh, it is this. That one? Yeah. Toby is very sussy. Sussy. What? You know, I don't know what that means. What does sussy mean? Is that like a new kid thing that kids say? Is that how we pick out the 11 year olds in my chat? Ooh. Hmm. Sussy baka? I don't like that. I don't, I'm gonna just. Can I make that known that I don't like that? <laughs> Is that a. Hmm. I think it's five head. Hmm. And look at that. Wow. Is that PBT Toby? On That's board? PBT Toby. That actually doesn't look bad. No, it looks pretty nice. It looks way better than the old set. I'll wow. tell you that. Like, 
Let's pull that out again. Yeah. It's just like so desaturated. Like just, just look at that. They messed up <laughs> so bad on the green. Yeah, that green is so bad. Yikes. Wow. Yeah. So, I mean, even taking a look at the legending even, like, look at... Oh, where's the... My my personal favorite? No. Um, oh, <laughs> oh, man. The, the, just wait. This, get, this gets better as it goes on. <laughs> look at that. Look at it. I love you know, that dollar sign. I, I prefer my dollar signs hanging over the edge, so, you know, I can relate. That's, that's a rap lyric. Dollar sign off the edge. Dollar sign off the edge. Oh, oops. There you go. Okay. Okay. Well. We did it. What do you think? This is so squashy. I don't like this. Why? <laughs> Why does that sound so bad now? That was tuned. I swear it was tuned. He swears. He swears. Why is that so squashy? It might be the key that's squashy. <laughs> hmm? Come on. Hmm. Aqua Kings kind of suck. Um in that respect for stabilizers. So here's what I'll do. That's why I like Aqua Kings, but not on stabilizers. So I'm visualizing this on a Type Master. Same. Oh, wouldn't that look sick on your Type Master? I'm trying to find my Oh, you want to hear the worst switch ever made, Toby? Oh no. Oh Here you no. Go. This it's is from Shoops. It's blue, so I hate it. That's all. That's all I know. Yeah, show that to Let the me... camera. It's, it's double blue, so you know it's gonna be double bad. That's that's all I know. Let's get it nice and close. Ah! It's actually peaking my microphone. <laughs> I'm get so sorry. Out. Oh, you don't want to put that in, the, <laughs> in my enter key? <laughs> Where's your trash bin? Where this belongs? <laughs> Oh, no, it's a gift from Shubes. I'll cherish it forever. This is somehow worse than my Steel Series space bar. This is like. Why are these. <laughs> my stabs aren't returning properly. Oh, God. Imagine a full keyboard of this. This is how, this is how you lose friends and family, right there. Is that. Hmm. I wonder, is it the enter key? Hey, Zona. You keep that slander out of here. Zona likes clicky switches. No, he says, I have an irrational fear of the color blue. Oh, no, blue's a great color. Blue is a great color. Hmm. Slander. That's how you lose your career. The uh, the next Hippio video, um, how I became a washed up keyboard YouTuber, there's your title. We're already there. Ugh. You guys like that, right? <laughs> <laughs> that's what you subscribe for? I, I'm pretty sure that's what they subscribe for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, anyways, the Aqua Kings kind of suck. But, look, it's PBT Toby, and I need to redo my stabs. The moral of the story is I don't like Margri stabs. That's what I've decided. Because um, mm. they're just impossible to tune. Uh, my favorite color is teal. Here, give my... So, I mean, the moral of the story is the stabilizers are scuffed, but we tried our best. We tried our best. Um, but here's what we're gonna do. Let's make it normal keycap normal. set. Cause yeah, you know, normal. PBT Toby can look normal. Normal. Uh, Lockrish, there's a there's a really easy way to fix your problem there. Um, if you go if you go at the bottom, you'll see a join button. Uh, that'll reactivate your membership to Hippio. It's pretty easy. Well, that's um, pretty crazy too. Wow. And 
I've heard you can actually type exclamation point join as well. Wow, no way. They yeah. make it so easy. I hear they make it really easy to Wait, alleviate is... that. What are the... Is there no F1 and F2? No, no, no. Which you want the... F3 and oh, F4. It's... Okay, I got the, the colors yeah. mixed up. And then you want to replace F5 through 8 with the green ones. Wait, did they give us enough green ones? I see F5... F7 and F8. Do you see F6 anywhere? No. Did they not give me an F6? <laughs> oh, there it is. Oh, sorry. Sorry, oh, microphone. Just punch the microphone. Sorry, I'm so sorry. Just beat it up. <laughs> I'm so sorry. F6. That's just really weird placement of keys. F5, F6, F7, and F8. How much will PBT Toby be? Priceless. Priceless, potentially $69, but honestly, so looking at these white keys, it seems like they scuffed up the white keys more than they scuffed up anything else. That's impressive. Which is weird because from talking to factories, the white keys are the easiest ones to get right. Let me see if I can take focus. Yeah, so the white, or the skin color keys have lightning at the corners. Which is like ridiculous. Where's the E and the I? Am I blind? Look to your right. Oh wait, what? <laughs> Hold on. Am I? Oh, they're in my hand. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. <laughs> professional. Professional right. YouTuber, by the way. Oh, professional dummy dumb. <laughs> okay, let me look at chat. Um. So yeah, if PBT Toby remains as is. I don't know, maybe $69, maybe $59. Uh, the, the quality's not quite as where I want it. Like, it looks fine as a set, but when you really look up close, it's a little bit upsetting. <laughs> um, uh, where's the B? The B. Did they not include a B? I think they might have not included a B. I... <laughs> Why would they not include a B? I know what to do. What? We're saving the stream. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> there you go. Oh my god. Fenny? That's for you, Fenny. <laughs> That's what the 8 would look better. <laughs> Wait, this is not about looking better. Put the 8 on there. Oh, dude, look at the E and the I. They're the wrong profile. No. Look at that. You're kidding. Look at that. You're kidding me. I don't, I don't know if I can get this to... Did they do that with the first set? And I just didn't get it. <laughs> Dude, who needs like scalloped homing keys when you can have protruding homing keys, right? I think they did that with the first... <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell is this manufacturing? They had one job. <laughs> they had one job. Yeah. I I am getting a new factory, Here, man. This is ridiculous. <laughs> That's amazing. It's I like, mean, okay. So as it looks, it looks like a good set, you know, from a distance. And then you like you get close to it, and then you want a restraining order. <laughs> why, is, why is the E a different profile? <laughs> why? That's amazing. Oh my god. Oh, oh man, I love do? that five key and now on change. Wait, hold on. Change it. PVT Toby five is the Oh god. Well thanks thanks, Fenn. Thanks. Uh what is, how's that space bar? Why does that look like a GMK set? It ain't. <laughs> I mean That's for sure. It's decent enough, but then it's so scuffed at the same time, like I'm oh, actually... dude, F11 is a different profile. No, you're trolling me. Look at that. No, 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 it just needs to be pressed down, right? No. What? <laughs> Why? Let me... It's F11. How do you mess up F11? Look at this. <laughs> How the hell do you mess up F11? Bro. That's amazing. Oh, look, and delete is as well. well but that, I guess delete, that's fine. delete might that's, have There's to be probably elsewhere. a proper delete. Um, it, it's probably this or wow. this. 
One of those Why two. Why am I bothering putting that on? It doesn't matter. <laughs> no, it matters. <laughs> it matters to me. If there's one less key that could be scuffed, uh, I'm gonna put it on the damn keyboard. Hold on. There's my delete key. I think it's this one. Uh, yeah, it's either that or this. Oh, which one is least scuffed? That's wrong. No, this one. Oh, wait, which one? Well, why does that look so bad? They're just hiding oh. the bad ones. Oh my. Yeah, I'm going with a different factory. I'm well, over like, this. Delete the factory, am I right? <laughs> Aren't these the same profile? Probably. Did they not even look at the profile of the keys that I gave them? <laughs> I or think the file I'm starting to think if you ask this factory like what profile they used, it'd be like Facebook? Instagram? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Hey, what profile do you we use? We have many profile. Yes. But as far as like actual sound of the keycaps, it's not bad. It's not bad. Um, they they feel pretty nice. Yeah. Um, it's just like their their weird color. <laughs> Why is their the weird e colors? I? Their weird like F eleven. Why? What? The... <laughs> Are they the wrong profile? Um, some of them, some which makes it them. worse. <laughs> Only s why they have one job with the E and the I. And then the space bar. And then I didn't give you an alt B. How did it go from a GK68 build to a cyberboard build? Toby. We like to have fun here. Toby. That's how. That's how. It is all Toby. I was literally about to take a nap and I get a text from Hippio saying, Hey, you want to review PBT Toby? And I was like, it's all Toby. <laughs> causing me pain. Yeah, let's look at this F11 one more time. Look at that. You know, for me personally, I like all my keycaps to not line up together. I think that's really uh, the future. Um, and you know, we like to be progressive and future oriented here at Hippiotech. So, you know, really he's an innovator. That's what you need to take we innovate. away from this. And by innovate, I mean <laughs> cry. Cry. Ugh. Oh, the E is, the E is, like, shifted on this, too. I can't tell if that's just because of the profile. Look at that. It looks like they, like... No, that's, yeah, that's misaligned. Yep. <laughs> yep, that's misaligned. What are these? This is a uh, PBT Toby. Uh, this is keycap set designed by Hippio after me. At this point, I don't even want to take credit for the design. <laughs> <laughs> designed by... A guy. <laughs> the, I, I grabbed some random guy off the street and I handed him Adobe Illustrator and I said, here you we go. Can, uh, we can just pin it on Larry. Blame Larry. Yeah, this is Larry's fault. Yeah, Larry. Larry, my editor. <laughs> Memes abound. Indeed. Something about this board triggers my fight or flight response. Good. It should. Yes. Yes. This is, your, as Lockridge put it, your sleep paralysis demon. So, so lags, uh, you're really onto something here. Um, there, there may or not be a reason why I wore this here today. It's the Toby outfit. I miss the eyes and the nose. Honestly, yeah, bring back. honestly, same. Bring, bring them back. I think you could keep the eyes and the nose and leave the hat off. We don't have to put the hat on. But the, they, <laughs> well, I literally. I told them everything. I told everything. them everything. I spent so much effort. <laughs> Not really. But Not where's the beard? Effort. It's right here. That's the beard. Clear. Clearly, this is definitely the, exactly the same. Can we put as the my nose beard. back on. Put the nose back. On. Yeah, we put the nose. Sorry, Fenny. Your five's going in the garbage. Hmm. Toby, can you take your hat off? Nope. Got him. Got him. You'd have to donate to Toby's personal PayPal, like three grand. <laughs> three grand. Three grand. But, uh, it's fine. Wait, hold on. Oh, it's me, it's Toby. Subscribe to Hippiotech. Yeah, this one. There you go. Oh, do I have to do the bit again? Yeah, you gotta do the bit again. 
Oh, it's me, Toby. Subscribe to Hippio Tech down below. Buy my new merch. I have new Yeehaw and Sandwich merch. Ooh, subscribe to Hippio. All right. Yeah. Never doing that again. I, Toby said it best. <laughs> yeah, exclamation point merch. Exclamation point join. I did this for you guys. I was going to go do something, and then 10 of you joined, so now we have Toby on stream. <laughs> so, congratulations. Woo! Damn, it's, it's like he's hippio. It's like he's hippio. Oh, this man. this yellow still bothers me. No, I love that yellow. I don't know. You don't like that yellow? I, I mean, think I really enjoy it. I'm just not a big yellow fan. I, I hate the color yellow. Where do I subscribe to Toby's YouTube channel? Uh, Toby doesn't have one, Matthew Francis. <laughs> Toby needs so, to make uh, a YouTube channel. What you should do is... Um, all the money you're gonna spend on me, uh, there's a donate button down below, a super chat. Uh, send him something so he can afford a better factory. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to buy prototypes from a different factory, which uh, yeah, might be a bit of money. Might be a little bit of money. Well, you know, you can follow Toby on Instagram. That's He's true. a woodworker and he makes wooden keyboards. That's true. You can find them at Barrett Creative on Instagram. At Barrett underscore creative. That's rather. me. That's Toby. He gives away coasters sometimes. I do. Um, I have... Builds cool wooden KL90s. I have a cool coaster partnership coming up with another keyboard influencer. So there you go. keep your eyes peeled if yeah. you like that kind of thing. Um, E1. Uh, E1 here. He, he won a set of coasters that's true and a, and a wrist rest he can attest to their quality mm. if he doesn't um he's getting unmodded yep <laughs> that's accurate yep accurate will there be other options of what of what of toby of pbt toby oh dude the five look at the five the no five is hold two. on no 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 you're, you're bluffing okay okay you're bluffing mm. you're bluffing yeah let me let me press him you're bluffing, please. Dude, I don't think I'm bluffing. Look at like some of the the numbers. <laughs> Are no, no, no. That's just the stamps I haven't. Is set. it? Yeah, yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah. Are you in denial? No, no, no. This is perfect. You you want to look at that again after you do it? Yes. <laughs> you want to check the Carfax real quick? No, this happens with Infinity sets too. <laughs> What? <laughs> We're getting a different factor. It happens all the time. Well, it does normally. All right. I'm already dead. I'm already dead. But this is the fun of transparent design. Also, be careful pressing keys because that's connected to my computer now. And now um, we're RGB Toby. But that's the fun of transparent design. I get to show you how much these suck, which a lot of factories don't show you because it makes them look really bad. <laughs> um, evidently, I'm used to looking bad, so I don't really care. But, yeah. I wonder what he mouthed. You don't want to know what I mouthed. It he wasn't said, YouTube friendly. He said, oh gee, I sure do love this PBT Toby factory. <laughs> End quote. This, this factory made PBT Doby. <laughs> Do That's <laughs> accurate, creamy keys. <laughs> That's PBT Doby. Hold on. PBT Doby, we'll just take one of the eyes away. It is cherry profile. <laughs> no. There you go. No! PBT Doby. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, uh, goodbye, lamb. I hope you have good nightmares, because I sure will. Mm. It's the AliExpress PBT Toby. This is the Wish.com Wish PBT Toby. Wish.com. AliExpress PBT Toby is slightly better. <laughs> or you know what? This so is that's Wish. Wi that, this that's Wish.com wish. wish. PBT Toby. That's Wish.com Toby. God, yeah, just looking at this hurts me and then that's aliexpress pbt toby pretty soon we'll get to like bang good pbt toby and then potentially aftermarket ebay pbt toby that would be perfect that's what we're he, really shooting for he mouthed the entire declaration of independence oh, what are your feeling what, uh, how do you feel about nick cage hmm. have you ever seen nick cage and hippio in the same room i didn't think so He's very intense. It's very intense. It's very intense. Are we gonna get a PBT Hippio though? 
That's a great question. I'm glad you asked. Uh, no. <laughs> um, <laughs> but you might get a PBT Hippo set in three months, maybe? Maybe? Four months, maybe? Something like that? What he means to say is four years. Keep so, your eyes peeled. <laughs> Keep your Other colors going to be released. Peel, I hope, I hope not. all of them open like this. Yeah. We just need to keep on... I'll just wear a different outfit, uh -huh. and we'll just run different PBT Toby sets. I'll get some, like, different hats made. Yeah. It'll be a series. Yeah, we'll get a series made. It'll be like uh, the Marvel Cinematic Universe, but way worse. Way worse. <laughs> way worse. We'll bring out Alfred Sprayler. Alfred Sprayler will be there. When will you make a GMK set for realsies? Never. <laughs> I probably won't touch GMK. Um, yeah. Yeah. Hey, how are you, Hippio? Oh, I'm doing fine. It's me, Hippio. Oh, hi there, Mr. Man. We're doing all right. Yeah. We're, we're doing all right. We're a little sad about we're pretty sad. Uh, the uh, quality control. Yeah. I'm pretty <laughs> yes. devastated, honestly. <laughs> I don't think they had any. Like, the quality was not controlled. When, when this is like the prototype set that you send to like impress... I don't know where like these things go. Your man. client or whatever. It's pretty rough. Yeah, don't. Uh, Leah, the wrist is doing okay, but it's still pretty hurt. But we're really trying our best. I'm trying to heal. I'm going on vacation next week. I'm trying to, I'm trying to get better in time. You can use the scuffed five as an accent escape key. No, I think it's like scooped. It's like a scooped row two. Yeah. Yeah. It's odd. It's weird that they have the capacity to make like kind of a scooped key. Um, but then, yeah. You should make custom Toby escape. <laughs> Perfect. This is what you wanted, right? This is what you asked for. Oh, I don't like that. That looks like <laughs> something naughty. Oh God. That, that looks naughty. We don't want the that. The five is an artisan. Yeah, it's True. an artisan. True. Two hundred dollar resale value on Mech Market. Actually, let's try the, the. Aquarius said he would pay any amount for a PBT Toby prototype. <laughs> so you guys think I could pawn this off on him for like five hundred dollars? I mean, it doesn't look that bad with the B. It kind of looks funny, honestly. What do you think, Chet? With the with the nose colored space bar. That's kind of funny. Kind of dumb. <laughs> kind of dumb. I, we're well past that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're well past that. We're four hours into a live stream. Oh, man. I'd pay you shipping for that Artisan 5. <laughs> oh, hey, Aquarius. You want to buy this for $500? I knew you would. I'll sign it. Toby will sign it, apparently. Although, I'm pretty sure my signature is so bad it would just devalue anything it goes <laughs> on. Alright, they want a sound test. A sound test again? Yeah. No! Space bar's good. Yeah, this anarchy though. It's so bad. Morgri stabs, dude. Morgri stabs. If Toby signs it, I'll pay 5k. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. Giving this keycap set to someone for free would be a ripoff. Hey! Hey! Pipe down. Hey, this is a beautiful set that's really ugly. <laughs> that makes me sad. But you know, it is what it is. It is what it is. At the end of the day, it is what it is. It's a keycap. It's a keycap set that was made. It didn't take a year. <laughs> it didn't take a year. I've gotten two prototypes done in what a month and a half, something like that. And it would have been way quicker had customs not lost the first one. <laughs> So that's not, they, you know. They, they really just threw it in the trash, I think. I think so. Wait, 
I just they they must have done a different box or something. I don't know. It's what you wanted, right? Something's not right. What did you want? The five? Do you want on the five? That's disgusting. <laughs> Flag that is demonetized. I kind of want to like keep this and just like put it on my desk. The five? <laughs> no, I need to send them a picture of it actually. <laughs> what is this? I see that. If I even, I don't even know if I want to go to this factory. Yeah, I don't know. There, there's a whole lot more issues than we originally kind of thought. The more I look at it, I mean, the more issues I see. Yeah. And that makes me sad. Did you put okay, the other? Okay, so I the think space I think the F11 is actually fine. It's just this switch is so squashy that it doesn't return properly. Oh, that's an Aqua King. Yeah, that's a classic Aqua King. Yeah. Let's see here. What are they saying? What are they? Saying? What did the people say? Oh, somebody's saying exclamation point join. Great work. Keep it up, proud of you. Sign the five key. I want to put TPT Toby on my KVD 67 light and Tiffany color, the green on green. Ooh. I'm not hating, but. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like you're hating. You watch yourself. Oh yeah, we need to get a Rama artisan. Oh, oh man. God. Let's get a Rama collab. What if, um, you mean the box? What if it was just like a really horribly engraved just version of this image on a tiny aluminum keycap? That's I'm, brilliant. I'm, I'm sure that key? I'm sure that would look great. Yeah. <laughs> they want a Rama artist number or, five. Oh yeah, I was I was gonna say. Just have that as like the escape key and no one will understand. That's why a good a meme for like a hundred people key. that are here watching on yeah. the stream. Well Yeah. We did it. Kind there you of. go. We did it. The factory did not. We did it. The <laughs> factory did not. Um, for those of you that came and, and visited today and watched Toby come on stream, you know, thanks for that. Uh, I hope you thoroughly enjoyed the PVT Toby time. The Toby time. The Toby time. Um, oh, we could get a hat on that. There we go. Yeah. So. I, let me let me go to the the full one. We did it. We there we go. I hope you enjoyed the Toby time. Um, I hope you guys had it had a great time. I'm so much taller than Toby. That's why I'm up here. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> that's so mean. <laughs> um. Anyways, we're gonna take off. Uh, we saved the city. We built the Toby board. Um. Uh, I'll probably I'll post some other additional infos it looks really good like that when you don't look when you when you have it over here yeah and you don't touch it and you don't look at it it looks it's great, great. <laughs> i hope you guys had a great time uh if you want to check out more streams make sure you get subscribed make sure you join the watering hole gang by hitting the join button down below um and then yeah thanks for toby for coming out and Ooh. building the board and looking at my sadness I'm looking at um, for one game. Oh. Hey, hey, hey. Listen here. If you squint, it looks good. If you squint, it looks great. Put the set in the washing machine. We could do that. Where it truly belongs. Maybe that would fix the, the color. Maybe. Maybe. I... Washing machine Chan is, uh, you know, it might happen. Is the inner key the wrong profile? Don't even, don't even. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm already too Just sad. Stop looking. If you can't see it, it looks good. Anyways. Adios, everyone. Farewell. I hope all of you take care and goodbye.